and clip. My CTE acting up. Nigga. <laughs> now we are. Up. <laughs> <laughs> now we are hot. All right. What's good, y'all? Welcome to an episode of another episode of the Press Box. I'm here with G Baby, Riddell, Lonnie, Random, Jalen, and Trent. I think early and Bama will join us later. But with that being said, y'all, let's just get right into it. I got this the title, so we'll do a tier list on wide receivers. But obviously, breaking news: the Bills trade wide receiver Stefan Diggs to the Houston Texans. Honestly, I didn't have anything prepared for that. So Really just want to hear your thoughts and commentary on what happened. Obviously, what are your thoughts now about Houston with this acquisition? And honestly, too, I would wonder some of that ill will that we speculated between Diggs and the quarterback in Buffalo. I think there's a reason why some of this is yeah. happening, obviously. And I also want to give you all some context. If you don't have all the information, it's actually cheaper for them to it was actually cheaper for them to keep digs than to move them. So that also give y'all some context there. So G, you could since you saved us, you go first. Yeah, 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 yeah. Um, uh, it's really because J Rob, I am gonna ask you a question after everybody goes, specifically to you. But as far as this move goes, they're really kind of following the blueprint, in my opinion, that the Bengals did. Just they traded for a receiver instead of going get one. The Bengals, they had T. Higgins, they had Joe Mixon. They were is Joe Burrow. He got hurt his first year, but we saw the flashes, and it was like what we all thought. Penny sold. You should go get that guy in the draft. He's sitting right there for you. What did they do? They went and got his college teammate Jamar Chase. The rest is history. The te- the Texans, in my opinion, are doing a similar version of that. They just saw C.J. Stroud have arguably one of the best rookie seasons ever, if not the best. They saw, okay, Tank Dale, he was balling, he got hurt. Nico Collins, he was balling when he had to step up. Don Don Schultz is serviceable. You know, Mm. they they just picked up Joe Mixon, so the running game is at the very least going to be the same. So they're looking, they're like, okay, we got our young pieces on defense who stepped up and played a lot better than they originally did. What should we do now? And they said, you know what? We have to deal with a Mahomes. We have to deal with a Joe Burrow. We have to deal with a Lamar Jackson. Let's go lock in and put our offense, which is already expected to be really, really good, over the top with, let's be real, an X-Factor type receiver, a game-changer type receiver in Stephon Diggs. That's literally what they're doing. And I personally feel Diggs on this team, now elevates them, in my opinion, to top three. I'm willing to concede the Jets if y'all believe Aaron Rodgers is still going to be Aaron Rodgers. If y'all believe that, then fine. I, I Because their defenses, the Chiefs, the Ravens, and the Jets' defenses are all better than the Texans. So I'm willing to concede them as the teams. After that, though, nobody's really moving me to be over the Texans. And it hurts to say it. I'm a T-Law guy. Really wish we would be the ones making this move. However... I cannot deny that the Texans are now, in my opinion, a top three, top four team in the AFC. In my personal opinion, I feel like with this, their expectations, they should be. They they really should be in the chip game, but not everybody can get there. The only teams I would understand if they didn't make it realistically, if they lost to the Chiefs because everyone loses to them. So if they lost to the Chiefs, I'm not really – if they see them early – not really lose a sleep over it. If they lose to the Ravens again, not really lose a sleep over it. You feel me? But other than that, and maybe the Jets, maybe other than that, I feel like they should be a top three seed in this in, in the AFC. They're going to get a favorable matchup in that 6-7 seed. So at the very least, they should be in the same spot, but they don't have to see the Chiefs early. I'm not going to lie. I don't see why they can't be in the chip game. I'm not going to give him that pass. I think this is Super Bowl or bust for the Houston Texans right now. And I'm going to tell you why. This is why this is, this is a Super Bowl bust time, right? I think that the, the Texans now acknowledge that they're all in. To get this accumulation of weapons, Nico, Tank Dell, Stephon Diggs, Mixon, and with the defensive pieces you have, you can only accumulate this when C.J. Stroud is, is in his rookie deal. All right, so he, he has. So I want to say a Super Bowl bust is three year window. They're all in. It's Super Bowl bust within the next three years. Because after CJ signs signs that big fifty million dollar deal, a lot of these are, a lot of these guys are going to go. 
And with the piece they have on this team, I think they are a Super Bowl team. I understand the Chiefs, they have Mahomes, but with the Rashid Rice situation, him probably getting suspended, I have question marks about that. And I have question marks whether that defense for the Chiefs is going to perform the same way they did in the playoffs. So I, I do think, yes, the Chiefs, the Mahomes sure. factor is there. But I do think, again, this roster, the piece they have is going to be great. The one thing with the Stephon, the Stephon Diggs signing does too, it also kind of indirectly makes their defense better. I'm going to tell you why. This team right now is going to put up a lot of points. They're going to be they're going to be in, they're going to be putting up 20 30 points. They're going to be putting up touchdowns all first quarters, which means the uh, the the offense on the other side, they're going to be more passing situations. When you're down 14 nothing, when you're down 7 you're not going to be running the ball as much. What that's going to do is going to guy allow allow guys like um Will Anderson more, more opportunities to get to the quarterback, put pressure on him. They're going to be more throwing opportunities. It it adds um guys like the corner um Derek Stiley, he's going to get a lot, a lot of opportunities because I think a lot of quarterbacks are going to have to be forced to throw the ball. So he's going to be more situations where he can make plays. Jimmy Ward, Brandon Hall, these are, I think, safeties that can do – that are playmaking safeties. Even though they were a little injured this year, I think when healthy, they're playmaking safeties. They're going to be put in positions to make more plays for the defense. So I think defensively, this helps them. And offensively, how do you combat three wide receivers like this? You have two corners. What are you going to have a linebacker guard one of them? You're going to bring a safety one. You can't have over-the-top safety help for all these guys. So someone's going to be wide open most of the time. So I think offensively, this is just a cheat code having these three guys. But again, when we look at the top teams, the AFC, AFC, the accumulation of talent and the way we talk about CJ Strout, the greatest rookie season ever, now in sophomore with the pieces he have, I think it's Super Bowl bust. Getting to the AFC championship game would be cool. But in my mind, with the, with the pieces they have and the way we talk about CJ, because we, we're going to give him all that praise, rightfully so, I'm going to hold him accountable to that level where – if he meets, if he meets uh, Patrick Mahomes, the AFC Championship games, uh, there is the expectation that he can beat him. To me, it's, well, it's real, the point. Real quick, you said three years. I was just talking next season. Oh, okay. Here, yeah, I, I'm, I'm talking about until the end of CJ Stroud's contract. I think once he hey, gets bro. paid, the, one of these guys have to go, and probably a big defensive piece has to go because oh, this is what happened. Once the quarterback, can we see? Hold on, we see it with Brock Purdy's situation. We see it coming. Once he gets paid, one of those guys got to go. We see with the Bengals. Once uh, um, Joe Burrow got a big deal, some of the pieces got to go. Um, it's it just that's the way the NFL works, and I think everyone kind of realized now the most opportunistic time for you to give your quarterback the most pieces is when a quarterback is on his rookie deal. So mm-hmm. when it comes when it comes to the situation, one, oh, you said Super Bowl or bust. CJ's twenty two years old. Their best that. player is like 21, 22 years old. Yeah, so like Super Bowl bust. That's kind of stretching it. I do feel like they should go deep in the playoffs. They have to at least win one to two playoff games at least, <laughs> but. We've talked about it before. Uh, Stefan didn't want to play, didn't want to be in Buffalo. That that was clear the way he was acting, the way that his relationship with Josh Allen deteriorated. Where like you could clearly see that Josh is not looking for digs like like that. And like a good portion of the games that we had when we saw like oh he was getting like one to two targets a game for like a good stretch of games. We were like okay. when they went on their win streak, he wasn't getting targeted. I agree. Yeah. So we we all knew that he was eventually gonna get moved and. He has what three years left on his deal. By the time that deal is done, he's gonna be a lot older. He's gonna be on the. He's definitely gonna be past his prime, and they can let him. And they can let him go because that's around. But the was time he not day. getting targeted, or was he just not open? He was not getting targeted. Yeah, he was not getting targeted. They were clearly they had a different. And when he did, they get had targeted, a different game plan. And then when he but did, he was get, complaining when he was getting spammed. When he did, when he did get targeted, yeah. like like the big plays that he's supposed to have, Josh Allen was overthrowing the shot at him. A lot of the times, charges games, all types of shit. So, that's yeah, I thought saying. there were times where he was getting open, but he just wasn't getting the ball. So, especially, and that happened after his brother was saying, like, yo, Josh Allen ain't shit right now. So, that was going on. And when it comes to like the Texans still have a whole lot of cap space, so they can still make moves. They still have a majority of their draft picks. They traded the second round pick that they traded belonged to the Vikings. So it's like it's not like they're really giving up any of their real capital. And like I said, by the time they have to actually pay any of their like top five, top six players, his contract's gonna be done. By the time they have to pay Will Anderson, CJ, Tank, Nico, I think they have to pay in two years. That's fine. Stingley, Stingley's coming on to his third year, so they, they he they still have time to pay him. So all their major pieces they have time for. And like we said, like, oh, they need to address, they need to get another pass rusher. They just signed Daniel Hunter. Who Adele was talking a lot about when he was on the Vikings because he was he was balling last year and now it's up to being the first option. I did the second option. Yeah. I did so too. I think they, they, might be moving me. 
<laughs> yeah, I'm not gonna lie, Riddell. What you was talking about in the chat, I totally forgot they had I'm, Daniel. I'm Ryan. not gonna hold I'm, you. I'm, they're, I, they're good. I, they're I, good. I legit yeah. said I'm in the chat that I hope hopefully their defense can like basically hold it down. I mean, hopefully their pass rush can hold it down because I believe in that pass rush. Yeah, but you oh, were saying that, that they you were y'all were y'all was trying to make the argument that oh they need they should have went. And got a defensive piece. They did. <laughs> they did. No they no, 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 I was talking about linebacker. If, if they if they go get a White for a one year Singley, movie deal, Singley is arguably oh, a top ten or will be a top ten corner. I'm so not like, one corner. I'm so tempted. So that's why I'm I, I finished my point. I think they, I think the only thing they really need to address in the draft is that's racist. Tredavious White's on the Rams. Yeah, he's on the Rams. But now I'm so tempted to see. I'm so tempted to say Texas Jets. Jets. Yeah, also, be. they can still sign Xavier Howard. Like, they can still get a good corner. No, 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 no. They don't need to sign him. Is yeah. Stephon Gilmore on the market still? Yes, he's uh, still on the market. Is Stephon still there? Yeah. If they get Gilly, I'm with you early. I'm with you early. That would be a good pickup. Yeah. Getting Gilly? Yeah. is a good pickup. I'm saying, and they, yeah. have, they have more than enough cap space to afford it. They have more well, than Number one, this is probably going to go down. Like, It'll be a one-year rental. The Sean Watson trade is probably going to go down as one of the greatest trades ever for the Houston Texans ever. Just as a trade, period, as a fleece. Because good God, like the way the way that we, we thought, like the Texas was gonna be a shithole after Deshaun Watson left, and then now we're seeing this. Now we're about to see what the Texas is so crazy. But I'm not gonna hold you. I'm y'all. sorry, but I'm sorry, but after what happened with Deshaun Watson, that was the greatest trade they ever made. Like they saw a bullet coming and they they got rid of it. Like that was that's a good trade. No, I'm saying though, no. I, like I, I just think they just the they really. Even though I had the Texans, I had the Texans winning the division. I think they really locked it down 100. No guarantee they're gonna win the division. Yeah, that's. I'm so tempted to say it's the Tex- Texans, Jets, and ASU. I'm so tempted to say. It. I think they're going to the ASU. Uh, that's the type honestly, of that's honestly, the type of um, standard they should be held to. They should be held to. I mean, I'm yeah, not, AFC they should. They should be. Te- no, they yeah, should no, be. No, 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 no. You're right. Sure. I'm not disagreeing with that at all because I call them a top three team in the AFC. But also when, but like, you I, think, I don't receiver. see Mahomes not being in the. I was AFC looking team. at their receiver. Oh yeah, that's a that's a fair point. One thing, one thing I want to bring to the table though is. I feel like this might be the most pressure a sophomore quarterback has ever had I've ever seen in my life. Not going to lie. C.J. Stroud expectations next year is going to be through the roof because he had the historical rookie season. We know mm-hmm. that. Now they gave him everything on offense. Everything. I ain't going to hold you. He built for it. He built the best OT in the NFL. They're going to expect he to, He's going to be number one in terms of MVP favorite. He's gonna be expected to go in the AFC Championship. Like CJ Stroud already is like, bro, you better, you better be that guy already. You better be top three quarterback already. That amount of pressure on CJ Stroud for a sophomore year, even though the term sophomore slump exists for a reason, ah, that's a lot of pressure. I'm gonna be honest, that's a lot of pressure on CJ. Yeah, that's I mean, right that might so. be the case, but hey, you you set that for yourself, gang. You balled out that year with. Let's be real, a worse offense than he's coming into this year. And sure. nobody's really going to cake for the O-line, but let's be real. The O-line, the continuity is there. You have another year. They kept their OC, who was a hot commodity for the for the uh, head coaching k- carousel. They kept him, so everything is the same, right? And then on defense, I, I'm, I'm not going to hold you. I, I really dead forgot about Danielle Hunter, bro. Danielle Hunter – to me, nah. like, like I'm not me saying he's, he's, he's not, he's not, he's not, he's not like he ain't like a, a Miles Garrett or anything like that. But opposite Will Anderson, Derek Stingley's still a guy, and D'Amico Ryan's just proved to us last year. And I might not have the greatest guys on this team, but I'm gonna have a solid defense. I'm gonna have a defense that's gonna play complementary football. And t- like they're really a bend don't break defense, just because they don't have the personnel to really be like a Every down, I'm going to shut you down type defense. But Daniel Hunter, opposite Will Anderson, helps with that. And I'm glad J-Rob is back, J-Rob. Because yeah, what, I, what did I miss? What did I miss? Give so, me so this, well, right. let me ask you this question, J-Rob, because I'm glad you're back. So mm-hmm. Verdell right. mentioned right now how mm-hmm. he feels like C.J. Stroud, as a, and this is probably the most expectations a sophomore quarterback has been under because of what they gave him and all this stuff. So I'm going to ask you. A question, J-Rob, because I know C.J. Stroud, your guy, Ohio State, you know, shout out him. Shout out to the Right? Man. But uh, we're probably going to get to the other part, like, in depth later. But I do want to ask you, as far as expectations go, mm-hmm. what are your expectations for the quarterback who lost Stephon Diggs and Josh Allen? What are your expectations for him this year and that, and that team and where they should be? I just want to know. 
The same, the same that I have with Lamar, Justin. Gotcha. Herbert, that, great. Herbert. W. That's all I needed to hear. I'm good then. Thank you. Where that, that's um, where the expectations should be. Gotcha. I feel like I feel like all of those quarterbacks who had to put in their careers is like we know what you can do in a regular season. What are you What are you going to do on the biggest stage? You know, that's what I'm it is going to be I, nasty I, if, I, if, I, if, I, if, if they get further. Like without, song, bro. No, but I'm saying it will. My it, honestly, the narratives are going to be nasty if Stephon Diggs is off that team. But let's say the Bills make an AFC championship. They football. the reason it's why they be might is I feel like they're going with a a formula of playing by committee. Like they're gonna get a lot of receivers who are quality. They're gonna go like two receivers in the first two rounds. They have Curtis Samuel, Shakir, and they're gonna Josh Allen doesn't have to worry about okay, I need to get it to dig. Now he's like, all right, I'm just gonna get it to whoever's open. It's kind of similar to Mahomes. That's what I think they're gonna be transitioning to. A run game with Joe uh what's James Cook. James Cook, Josh Allen, and then play a very not not like conservative offense. But a much more methodical offense. Well, can, can I, 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 I do think Curtis Samuel is a solid I, receiver? I agree. I agree with that, Riddell. But that. but can I play devil's advocate real quick? Before let's just be real, just for devil's advocate, before they got Stefan, it was looking a little rough. Now, even though I like uh uh the oh, what's the OC name? Oh, oh, uh, Brian, um um uh, Joe Brady. Joe Brady. Joe Brady. Joe Brady. Joe Brady. Joe Brady. I love Joe Brady. I think Joe Brady's great. I think Joe Brady's great. You know what I mean? But, like, the first year, Stephon, like, jo- Josh Allen, we always talk about when he's force-feeding him or when Stephon Diggs is not there, he look a little, you know, a little lost in the wind sometimes. So I'm mm-hmm. just saying, like, are we sure? I mean, it depends on who they get in the draft because I do agree with you. They should. Their first two picks should be nothing but wide receivers. They clearly said we don't care about the defense because they let everybody go. So might as well go get you some offensive pieces, Right. So I'm just saying for devil's advocate, Josh Allen, without Stefan, we always talk about even when Stefan's on the team, oh, Josh Allen, when he's not targeting Stefan, he's this, he's that, all that. So Excuse me. I don't I don't know if any if it's gonna be that too much different with Shakir and I mean I like Curtis Samuel, but mm, cool. I'm go ahead, Lonnie. Uh, I was gonna say also like yeah, their receiving core before that was really good with Tank and Nico, but at the same time, Nico ha- Nico's missed three. He missed like three games last year. The year before, he missed seven. The year before that, he missed like four or five. And Tank, we know he's a small receiver, and he just went in for a block and broke his leg. So it's like, yeah, they have explosive weapons, but those weapons haven't been consistently healthy. And so yeah, adding in a top 10 receiver definitely supplements that if one of them is going to be missed in and out of the lineup. My main concern for them just now, like I don't have, it's not even a big concern. The only thing I really think that they need is maybe another running back in term and for the offense. I, I believe in their O line, and like I said, like they have, they well, still have a round pick this year, second third round pick. They can they can yeah. pick up they can pick up another corner alongside Stingley, who's top ten. But like we said, Will Anderson and Daniel Hunter, that's gonna be a top five, top ten pass rushing duo yeah. in the league. So I really think like besides that, like linebacker depth. They're they have a championship level roster. Do I am I saying like oh they need to be in the championship? No, that's unrealistic. They have their whole roster super young. But do I feel like that's definitely possible? Yeah. I like I said to me they at least have to make it to the second or AFC second round of the playoffs. Yeah, or same AFC. spot they was in last year. They can't, they can't take <laughs> yeah. a step back. Like if they lose if they lose to Mahomes or they lose to a, like the no guys, that's the, the only one I'm allowing Mahomes. I'm be honest. Everybody that's, else that's that's, not, that's, that's, that's ridiculous. That's, that's ridiculous. I'm, I'm not allowing Every, no 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 that, no. That's ridiculous. I, I, I said ev- hold on. I said everyone else should be 50-50. That's what I said. That's ridiculous. Other than Mahomes, like okay, you lost Mahomes. Fine. Everybody I think else. That's like, ridiculous. I mean, if you're saying yeah, everybody like, else, oh, should they be definitely beat the Bengals. One out of one, one mic. Oh, one mic. One mic. Bengals are. Oh, they definitely beat the Ravens. Like no. The, the only reason. One mic. The only reason I'm fighting uh, against, especially the Ravens, when they've showed us time and time again that they're able to be a good organization that consistently goes at least deep into the playoffs with Lamar and without Lamar, until I see the Texans actually beat the Ravens. I'm never going to put them above them. It's still, like you guys said, it's still a young team. And Riddell, you just have to, until they do, I just can't believe it. I don't care what they have. That's that's a better organization, damn near top to bottom. How many times have they just shown you that they figure it out every year? They went bad for Ben. Uh, short, short, of being, short of being ravaged wow. by injury, 
Uh, five like short of being ravaged so, by injury, the Ravens are one of the best teams in football, one of the best organizations I'm, in I'm football. Not, I'm never going to say. I, I hear you, but to rebuttal that though, the Ravens you, have bro. also you, shown you, the Ravens have also shown you that they cannot come through in the clutch when it matters most. So, so, the, so does the in the same of breath. Other teams. So they can so the get if they can get caught. If they, but if they could, my point is, yeah, you are making my point because the you, point you, is, if they can get caught by the Titans. In peak Lamar in that peak defense, they can get caught by the CJ Stroud in the Texans. That's not. That's I'm sorry. If they can get caught by the Titans of Ryan Tannehill, they can get caught by uh, CJ Stroud in the Texans. It's not ridiculous, bro. Like, right, the I the only reason I'm saying that Lamar is clearly a better, different player than he was against the Titans. He clearly was. Oh, okay. He's a better passer. He's a okay. better passer, remarkably That's better. Passer. But he okay. With that being said, he also you can argue that his worst right. game or his second worst game also uh, in the AFC Championship against the Chiefs. And his and defense also, did the job. They only 14. And then also, too, when they play him in the playoffs, Tank wasn't there, and it was only just Nico. So all you really had to do was just, you stop Nico, you we win the game. Until the they half, do it. So now, until they all do that, it. All that, all, that, all that shit that they was doing, they the, like the Texans not getting past the 50 the whole game, that shit until dead. Until they do it, I'm dead, not going to give them that benefit of the doubt. Like, let's, let's relax on like the Ravens. Wait, wait, I'm, I'm not. I'm, I'm just saying they're not let, I'm not going to let y'all disrespect what the Ravens have continually we're shown you what they can do. What if they well, show me they could do right? We, now? Call, we said they were a top three team in the AFC. Like, what you mean? I don't. I don't. I understand that. I understand that. What the what the what the Texans have done is very good. It's actually a very good luxury piece. That and they, they can still add. They can still go to the draft and get pieces to 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 fix whatever holes they have left. But just because you have those pieces doesn't mean you can do it. What's the point of getting Stephon Diggs if it's not to beat the Ravens or the Chiefs? I got a question. How no, you, you, you got you. Go ahead, go ahead, go ahead, go ahead, man. So, so random, how you how you how you feel, how you feel about the Bengals? Because that's a team that kind of deplete is kind of de- depleting, and you telling me the Texans can't catch them? Can Can Joe Burrow stay healthy? That's their biggest problem. He made it to the Super Bowl though, so you're telling me you tell me the Ravens can Lamar? Oh, you haven't seen them make it nowhere. You haven't seen them. <laughs> okay, the okay. What well, oh, at this point? What's more likely? What's more likely right now? Joe Burrow is more likely. To lose to lose his season to injury or half 50 50 lose his seasons to injury. What are we talking about? Okay, so then, who? Actually, then who? Then who? Then then Lamar to win. Then then the Ravens. Can I, can I say this? Can I can I just can I just add this caveat about like what we're talking about? Like why don't I think it's okay to just acknowledge the fact that they're a good team. CJ Stroud just might be as good as everybody else. I, I understand so, that. And I, so I, and, I, and I, I think the reality and I think this the reality of it is when we talk about except my home. If CJ if CJ Stroud loses to Mahomes in the first round, it, okay. And I do think, and I do think with the way we have given second and third year quarterbacks soft landings in their career, mm-hmm. if CJ Stroud loses in year two in the first or second round, I don't think this is going to change the narrative of what we think of him as a quarterback and his potential because I don't think his regular season is is going to be bad. Mm-hmm. However, I do think all of us believe in what he's shown us that he is capable of especially in the way although i think the game plan that cj stroud and his team had against the cleveland browns was a bit better was better than what i think kevin stefanski had because honestly he didn't have to do a lot he just had to do the right things and make the right decisions with the football Mm -hmm. but that's also enough because some guys fold in that pressure that that's a that is a a good trait to have by him so i feel like he's in that class like if he goes band for band with Justin Herbert and beats the Chargers, or he beats Joe Burrow, or he beats Josh, or he beats Lamar, beats Deshaun, I'm gonna be honest, fellas. Like the AFC uh, stacked. If he loses, I'm not mad. Nah, but, but the thing is, like, if I look at the as stacked as the AFC is, like, I just think CJ's as good as all them guys too. Like, exactly. you know, what I'm saying? like it wouldn't be shocking for him to beat any of these teams. I'm not. Like, it wouldn't be shocking for exactly. any of these So that's what I'm saying. Them. Saying it's ridiculous. It's kind of like I, I, I think I, I the only, only person, reason I'm the saying it's ridiculous. I, the only reason I'm saying it's ridiculous is because of the cons- consistency, especially the whole team is that sure they haven't won the bowl. Sure they haven't won the bowl, but how can you look at everything the Ravens have done and just immediately? Okay, so let me ask you this, Randall. Yeah, let me ask you this, right? Yeah, they're the Ravens. Yeah, they have a good organization, but what did they do in the playoffs? They choked. I've seen them lose to That's what I, just yeah, I think them. niggas is off Lamar, man. Honestly. Like, what did it, like, I'm, not, I'm not even talking about Lamar, just the Ravens in general. What did no, they do? Yeah, I'm about to say he's talking about the organization. Yeah, I'm oh, serious. I've, I've, I've literally, do? I've literally tr- seen them lose to your teams. Like, it'll be different. See, random, I would hear your point if we were talking about the Chiefs. 
They okay. lose to the teams that they're, are under them. Like, okay, they're fine. Yeah, I don't, yeah, I don't think the, the, Look, the Ravens and the Ravens. The Ravens they're coming for losing. They're, 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 they're been been known. Known. Every time Look. they get to the playoffs, they always do this. So and, and, okay, and then half the, the time, Joe Burrow's watching watching his team on the sideline because he's gotten hurt. I'd, I okay, still trust him. I trust the Ravens. Hey, I trust the Ravens a whole more than Joe Burrow staying healthy. Why do you trust the Ravens when every time when it gets to the matters the most, they always vote? So so you're telling me. So you're telling me. Yeah, I I I, I so, don't. So think, you're telling me I right now you trust the Bengals right. more when knowing yes. that half of the time that Joe Burr has been in the Bengals uniform, he I don't watch we, this team. I don't you know. You know well, the two well, times I don't. Well, I don't think. Well, I don't think it matters of who trusts who more. I just think ultimately, like, and he'll be T Higgins and Tyler Bortles. I don't think. I don't think the measuring stick should be the Ravens. Yeah, I don't, that's what I'm saying. I don't think. Yeah, they, yeah, because they're all Honestly, in the same team. That's what I think it's the Chiefs. Like, yeah, that's, that's, that's really. Yeah, 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 yeah. That's, that's what I'm saying. Matter. Like, if they lose to the Chiefs round one, round two, well, they wouldn't play them in round one unless the Chiefs just somehow fall on a wild card. So, if they play them round two, they lose. Okay, cool. I can. I honestly, I care more about how CJ Stroud plays because when we look at last year with the Ravens, I came on this platform and I said, Lamar. There should be no reason if you look at this team on paper, there should be no reason you lose this game. But it mm. depends on you, gang. The defense did his job. If you if you tell a defense to hold any team, let a, let alone with the best quarterback in the league, yeah, we're gonna hold you to 14 points. Yes. You take yes. that. And he didn't play well. So if CJ Stroud comes out here, lays an egg, and pulls a Lamar last year. All right, cool. That's a different conversation. But if he just plays like regular CJ Stroud, he ain't even got to be nothing special. Just plays like regular CJ Stroud from what we've seen thus far. Him beating the Ravens, him beating the Bengals, the who who the Dolphins, the it, any other team other than yeah. the Chiefs shouldn't be a shock. It, it, is, it, is it nasty for me to say that if, if Stroud is in Lamar's position last year, they win that game? Is it nasty to say that? Against the Chiefs? Yeah. 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 It's kind of nasty to say that, but it's possible. Uh, it's it's tough, Flowers still fumbles at the goal line because that's, that's yeah. nothing no quarterback can control. I'm going to say, I'm gonna say we still have to add context to the game. I, 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 I know that we love to – I know that we have enjoyed that Lamar is played bad, and so we have to give him his slander for playing bad. But we also could acknowledge that Kim, yeah. Mul- Kim Mulkey and um, Todd Monkey – Clearly, come from the same coaching tree right now when it comes to big, uh, big games. So, yeah, throw it all out the window. <laughs> yeah, throw, the out, throw the book out the window, man. Yeah, so. yeah, yeah. And then also, too, if CJ Stroud was there, they wouldn't be calling. That time I want to, I, I do want to pivot with this question because we're talking a lot about the Texans and what they're going to be. But I do want to ask you this because I think this is something that we we haven't dived into enough. How how sour do you think the relationship between Josh Allen and Stefan Diggs had to get for the bill to take a $31 million dead cap hit to move him. Lonnie, I know you had your hand up. I'm sorry I didn't get to your point. Hmm. But, uh, but no, guys, I was, I was going to segue into the bills anyway. Okay, cool. Perfect, perfect. Perfection. Uh, when it comes to the relationship, I feel like since like maybe two seasons ago, things have, have things have been rocky. You see mm-hmm. like the arguments on the sideline. You see the, you see the side eyes. And you see everything that's going on. Then, like after they lost to the Broncos and Trevon made those comments or whatever, then you see like, oh, now all of a sudden he's not getting targeted. Yeah, they're still winning, but like, yo, he's not getting targeted. And you just see him just look upset, like he, he's just sick of the situation. And we were talking about it throughout all the season, like, oh, well, that's probably the best situation for him. But at the same time, you can tell he clearly doesn't want to be there. And yeah, I'm sorry, Buffalo's not like a awesome place i don't know if everyone anyone's been to buffalo it's not that fun it's really not i'm, I'm gonna it's give really y'all not. some insider information i'm gonna go last and get out the real truth but i'll give y'all some inside information okay. but, but, but i i'm not gonna go all the way and say that the bills are cooked but because there's still the draft but here, here's the thing with the draft yeah they they, are, they can go wide receiver twice in the round twice like in the first two rounds but they still don't have a pass rush they still don't have a good secondary who, who's their best pass rusher, Riddell? Von Miller. They had a pass rush last year without an elite. Is it? <laughs> <laughs> no, but might be Von Miller. Miller. Who, who's their best pass rusher? It might be Von. Well, so we they don't. Know the, we know the Bills well, defense. Took so they, no, Von, oh, I don't know if I was lagging. I, the Bills had an elite pass rush last year without Von Miller. So they'll be. Well, right. we know their defense took Von a turn once Matt Milano. Else. Once their once their quarterback of their defense went down. That's yeah, when they, 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 they got Ed Oliver, right? 
So, so with him coming Ryan. back, their defense should be better. And hopefully if he stays. So they, they, they lost both their safeties and they lost their best corner. So yeah, they, now, they addressed the wide receiver I'm position here. with rookies. If they address the wide receiver position with rookies, they still don't have a decent secondary coming into next year. And they and what didn't they lose their center this year? So it's like yes. so they have holes on the offensive line, they have holes in their secondary, and I don't I I personally but, didn't think that their pass rush was super elite. So, yeah, I feel like they're cooked because unless they're, they're going to be relying on rookies, they're going to be fighting yeah. for to make the playoffs. Yes, I but, however, I don't think, like, I mean, who knows? Who knows what the Dolphins did to it? But I still think they should be if you look at the rest. <laughs> well, actually, let me rephrase. Let's assume A-Rod is just going to be 85% A-Rod, just to be Yeah, I'm not going to lie. Let's just say I, he's 85% A-Rod. Wait, 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 also the coach, G, baby. Can I, just, can I just say something about the Bills, y'all, that I got to be honest about? Yo, the Bills might be cooked, bro. The just window's right. over. The window's closed. But it, Yo, well, okay, they, they, so have, they, have, they, have, they have $4 million in cap. Mm. That $31, yeah, they, have a, they have $54 million of dead cap. They got to fill up their sleeves. Oh, they're 28th in the league. Um, yes, so, but, Josh, but, but, Josh Allen and Von Miller already but, 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 J. Rob, already destroyed their contracts this summer. Ain't no, Rob, I, Ain't no excuses though. Ain't no excuses though. I was about to say, there. J. Rob, I asked you earlier about what you feel they should be, and you feel they should be in the exact same. Yeah, ain't no excuses okay, though. So, with that being said, with that being said, you look, you, hey, you, like, I feel like we can't say they're cooked and then be like, oh, but you still got to be in the same spot. Either they're cooked I just, or they're I not. Did, did, no, they're they're not cooked because they have Josh Allen. Yeah. But at the same time, they this is where <laughs> this is where you this is where you gotta make it. Wait, no, no, okay, no, so no, 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 I want to be. I want to. I want to make something very too. clear. I'm not gonna lie. If I don't think he the Jets win the division, he it's over, bro. No, 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 no tax. No, no, no tax. He's still in the league. You're not gonna give him the Herbert. No, 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 no. Herbert don't get a tax from me either. By the way, what? Jot? No, for sure not. Yeah, yeah. I know you, Manny. We know, we know, we know you a soft landing guy, Manny. But we don't do that. Feel bad everybody. Yeah, yeah. Everybody. I think people need to kind of realize for the Bills right now. It's not as bad as it seems. Now, the thing nope. is, losing both their safeties was bad, yeah. 100%. Could, could they kind of retool for that safety percentage? I don't know. I don't know. When he, losing both their safeties is bad. They Andrew still have White. good corners. They have Razul Douglas and that other guy uh, who was a really good slot corner. I forget his name, but he was a really good slot corner. <laughs> Who? Who? Hell no. No, 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 no. I think, I think someone said in the chat, it's Ben Ford. Oh, Johnson? No, Teron Johnson. That's who. Was, that's who. Mm-hmm. Yes, Teron Johnson. Seven, seven, number seven. Uh, they had a good pass rush last year without Von Miller doing anything. It was top five in sacks. And on, they linebacking core is gutted. They their linebacker unless Matt Milano comes back and he's he okay, so he it'll be all right. The thing is that the Bills, like I said, if the Bills can go in a direction where they play a very conservative, methodical offense and really still rely on those other pieces that are not big names but do their job because the bills have always had a good defense and i think they still will have a good defense next year i don't think they'll be tier one anymore i think they'll be tier two now but i still think i don't they're still a playoff team so So, trust josh allen do what he do but it's so the the cults are getting getting one mic one mic go ahead early so let me say this um Behind closed doors from reliable sources, um, the Bills felt like, from what I was hearing, is that the Bills felt like with Josh Allen. Um, so the consensus are most of us think that Stefan Diggs made Josh Allen. He wasn't good until Stefan came there. That's the consensus, not only in our eyes, but it's also in the organization's eyes. A lot of rumors going through and a lot of things that have been said that were being said behind Stefan Diggs and his camp. So what was the consensus was is that. They didn't feed him the ball when they went on that streak and got into the playoffs. They were a drive away from winning the game versus the Chiefs, which is their big honcho. And they feel like had they beat the Chiefs, they would have won a Super Bowl. So what happened was with Josh Allen and the Diggs rumorings, Josh, they feel like now Josh Allen is at a point to where he can do it. It ain't no more it's Stephon Diggs. That's it's basically Josh Allen is just now this upper echelon quarterback that can do it. He just need more weapons around him in general instead of being a one-two duo as far as a receiver goes. And they're also about to give Josh Allen a fat extension very soon behind closed doors. And 
with Stefan Diggs' contract, it's just more money to get off the books and also to put around him. They believe that instead of paying one guy twenty million plus, they can pay two or three guys that are, you know, get a younger guy too that he can develop with that won't be as asking for the ball, won't be as on social media, your brothers in the league. So behind closed doors, it wasn't just that the the relationship got bad. It was also the organization feeling like we have the actual head honcho in this situation, which is Josh Allen. And we could do without Diggs because they shown on that street when they wasn't giving Diggs the ball, how basically Josh was getting it, even in the playoff game. When you watch the playoff game, he was getting it off with what's the old boy name number 16? Shakir, 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 Shakir. He was getting off with Shakir. So mm-hmm. with that, what they're looking at is they're friends who like just look for if you're a fantasy football guy, just know that Don K will be featured heavily in this up up season, this, this upcoming season. Not mm-hmm. only that, they look at Josh Allen to be a guy that can get it done regardless. And this is a year for Josh Allen behind closed doors to not only elevate his game. But to look at being – because y'all all are saying, oh, man, we're going with CJ Stroud. But what it. you don't understand is that if Josh Allen gives you another 40 to 50 touchdowns, like, it's going to be the same situation. What I'm comparing it to is how they got rid of Steve Smith so that way Cam could really say, nigga, this is my team. Right. Right. They had to get rid of Steve because Steve was still the face of the Carolina Panthers franchise, and they needed Cam to step up and be the face of the franchise. Right. Getting rid of Stephon Diggs is the Steve Smith, Cam Newton moment for Josh Allen. If he goes out here and gives you 40-plus touchdowns all around, and they still get into the playoffs, that's your MVP. Yeah, they're not making the playoffs. I think the Bills. Yeah, no, I, I agree with that. Go ahead, go yeah, ahead, Jalen. Yeah, I just think that I just think that the way we're talking about the Texans today, in terms of you know the team, how stacked they are now offensively, it's the same way we talked about the Bills three years ago. After Josh Allen had that breakout season with forty five hundred yards, they added all these pieces. They're like, WB. all right, Super Bowl, this is their time. See how quickly that window just shifted. So quick, a couple losses here, injuries, guys get you know released, guys get traded, whatever the case is. That window closed so quick. So when I say, you know, with, with Texans, why Super Bowl bust, these windows end so quick. A guy can get hurt. The cap casualty situation, it happens a lot faster than people think. Because we thought a lot of people go build for the next decade. They run in that division. We didn't know CJ Stroud was coming like this. We didn't know the Texans. We didn't know, you know, the Jets were going to get Aaron Rodgers. The Chiefs were going to be them, the Bengals. Like, we didn't expect the rate. We didn't expect all these things. So with the Bills, it's just they, they had their window, and they didn't get to capitalize. Yes, a lot of that was with Patrick Mahomes. But now – it's there won't be the favorite. I think they're probably missing the playoffs next year for sure. Maybe the year after that, they do have to kind of. When you have a quarterback at the level of Josh Allen, who he is, you can kind of do a kind of a quick rebuild through the draft where you'll never be like a three win team. They'll never be that bad. But they, I, I don't think they win ten games next year. I think they're definitely a nine, eight, seven win team next year. Just, let me, let me answer. Josh Allen and some, and some let me answer this. My yeah. bad. Finish. Finish. Finish the last. No, no, I'm done. Yeah, yeah, that, that's probably yeah. I'm too much done. I'm. I'm a. Uh, Read the super chat real quick. JJTD, JJTV with the ten dollars super chat. I fuck with G Baby and Trent Heavy, but they always hating on eight. He was hurt the last two seasons, and he came back more complete. Y'all niggas don't know <laughs> what would have happened if he was there. They don't get mad but, because eight in the Ravens choke. Fuck. Go, go ahead, uh, go ahead, Lonnie. And like, go after him that, what, what does any of that have to do with how he played? On? I was gonna say. Like, like, I, I feel. I feel him like, though. He no, he, 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 he's big. Oh, he's big. He's big. Yeah, I was going to say, a big thing isn't about, like, whether the Bills can recover. It's about also other teams are getting be- better. The Colts are getting better. The Jets got a lot better because they got they don't have Zach Wilson. I'm sorry, anyone throwing the ball. He, A-Rod could be a top 20 quarterback, and it's still going to be leaps better <laughs> than what they had last year at QB. And they almost made the playoffs last year. Pittsburgh also got better. So and we still got the Browns. You still got the Dolphins. You still got the Ravens, the Chief, the Char- We expect the Chargers to improve with their situation. So it's like AFC is really competitive, and they, and they lost the top ten receiver, and they lost their starting safety, and they lost their starting safeties. Right. The Chargers is good at the whole team, man. I don't expect them to be good at all. I think this is a this is a tanky. I'm, I'm just saying the number of teams have also improved. That also could be they ain't allowed. They ain't allowed to tank. So like you got the Jets now back in the mix. You got the Chargers back in the mix. You got the Colts back in the mix, and hey, Titans are a wild card because. They're, they're they're throwing that they got Sneed, they got Ridley. We don't know what they're gonna do in the draft yet. Be nice. So and you still got Jacksonville. So it's like we we see all these teams. <laughs> Who 
Yeah, it's over for Jacksonville. Riddell, Riddell, go ahead and then I got it. I'm gonna I'm gonna answer this uh question and then we're gonna get to our tier list. Yeah, okay. So when it comes down to it, I feel like this could be a situation where similar to kind of like Brady and Rogers, and I know those names are good names. Don't overreact. All right, it's fine. Similar to Brady and Rodgers in the sense that they had their Super Bowl window at a point, and then there was a little bit of a low period where they were still good, and then they had another Super Bowl window. I can't. I don't see why Josh Allen can't have that same exact thing on the Buffalo Bills. When it comes down to it, they do have to rebuild this team. I agree, but the team is not as bad as they're all making it seem. Like they're still a pretty good roster. They need to revitalize that wide receiver room. I agree. But that's why I said they're going to go wide receiver by committee. And Josh Allen, like early said, he believes that he can do it like Patrick Mahomes in the sense that he doesn't need a star receiver. He needs his tight end, which is Kincaid, who is a dog. And he needs a bunch of other receivers go like, just make the play when I throw it to you. And if he actually does do that, then, yeah, we can see a Josh Allen MVP type season this year. And then if they keep on building this team, they could be a Super Bowl contender in another three years. Josh Allen's still young. It's not like yeah. he's old. Like, he's still Max. pretty young. So, yeah, they'll be fine, bro. We're over I here. think I, I agree. And I also want to say to his point, too, that Josh Allen, his his champion, as long as he's at quarterback, at quarterback they, they, they got, got an shot. opportunity. They got, got a, a shot. shot. And also, two fellas, you know. 27? He, he's a baby. It's called the NFL, and it's called the NFL draft, and it's called the NFL draft. Go draft well, because some guys can play. We've seen. Bro, you listen, seen with us? We seen with us in one year, shit. bro. Yeah, I would say the, the Jets. Yeah, the, the Jets. Yeah, I would say the Jets got changed because of a few drafts. Look at look at the Green Bay Packers. You draft well, things happen. I mean, even the even the Cowboys. You don't want. You know, we talk shit about them, but even the Cowboys. Zeke. They, they draft even well. even even with right. how even with how bad the the Bills uh, prospects look, I'm still taking them over half the teams that Lonnie named. I'm still taking them over the Colts. I'm still taking them over the Steelers. I'm still taking them over you the mind, Jags. Taylor. You out your mind? Huh? You taking them you over? You out the your mind? That's the are you taking them over the Jets? All right, brother. All right, brother. All right. All right. All right. All right. Come on. All right. All right. All right. Let me. Are ask you taking them over the Jets, Randall? No, no. But I'm t- no, I'm not taking the playoff spot. That's the playoff spot that wasn't there last year. That's a playoff spot that wasn't there last year. They don't have. They don't. Control. Okay. They. But hold on, y'all. Because I do want to answer this super chat. We still got a tier list to do. Opinions on the on the Dolphins. Shout out to Global member for six months. Make sure you. If you're not a member and you're watching this right now, make sure you get you a membership. And what are you waiting on? And also hit that QR code at the bottom if you want some good old merch. Opinions mm-hmm. on fans. What moves should we make? Go ahead, uh, Manny. They need to sign OBJ. <laughs> Who is our man? Andrew Penix. Yeah, they might. They might have to. They actually Andrew might Penix, sit him behind Tua. Who? Michael what Penix. team? So Bobby you, Penix. so so even though his medical, I'm sold on him going. Hey, to so look, even though his medical, me too. Penny, me too. Even though his medicals came out, me too. Good, that too. That's even right. though his medicals came out good, y'all want to replace the guy no, who everybody was worried about an injury with another guy with everybody who's worried about an injury. Like the difference is one can throw. You baby, that's 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 you, you're right. You're right. That's hey, one but, can but, launch but, that thing. Both, both for injury, bro. One can actually throw a forty yard bomb. Yeah, but one's not. Hey, and early, and early, and early, and early, and early. The other one ran, and the other one ran a four four. And the other one is six three. Yeah, I like Penix and two though. Well, the 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 Dolphins is gonna have to have a one hundred percent honest conversation with themselves about this Tua situation. Are you really just gonna fall? Like as much as I respect, I'll always respect Arizona for this. They draft Josh Rosen with a top ten pick, and they immediately realize this is not it, and go get Kyler the next right, year. Right. So many other teams would just be like, That's "We're just gonna example. get somebody, and we're gonna keep trying this." So I'm like, "Are, there, are them new glasses random?" OBJ to Chiefs, yeah. I would like that. I would actually got them, like got them, that. got them Aussie yeah. glasses on. I like them. Yeah, I like them. Receiver, bro. Resurgence year, but hold on. Let me get, let me get to this super chat. Another super chat by JJ TV. I guess he's not feeling y'all today. Still inexcusable how eight played, but y'all jumping on random because he's showing respect. <laughs> That's crazy to me. This was his first time back, and he went to the AFC champ. Just show some respect, man. They can keep it like a ball boy. Hey, chill that. out, I'll, dummy. I'll answer that because we we're not jumping on random because he showed respect for the Ravens. I called them a top two team in the AFC. They're not we jumped on random 
because he was trying to make it seem like, in in my opinion, that it's like impossible for oh, the know. for the for the Texans to or like that's like something he can't see. And I'm just saying, in a world where unless your name is Patrick Mahomes in that AFC with the weapons that they just gave him and how good he was last year, there should be no reason. Why they can't win that game? That's all we were saying. I'm, I'm done with as, that nigga Lamar Jackson quarterback play when it matters, dog. I'm as as I'm, me, I'm, I'm sitting there until I, mean, I need to see too, they're, young, not, they're a young uh, team. I need to see um, the Texans actually beat the Ravens. To, I just need to see it. Oh, we it oh my god! Yeah, this it's gonna be funny because this is gonna be nasty. Give, I'm gonna, I'm gonna give Riddell, uh, just give Riddell Garrett Wilson right now so we can. Cap, can we be? Can, but can, can we be for real? Can we be for real, guys? No, no. Can we be for real? No, 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 We'll I'm all talk. Right. We'll I'm talk right. about it. We'll talk about it. But yeah, I understand this list going to cause chaos. But remember, we only got an hour. Right. You Fact, feel me? Right. So like, Fair you gotta enough. be you. And I and I want y'all. And I want the discourse. I definitely want the discourse. But you feel me? Exactly. Like, right. yeah. Like if it's it can be, be punctual though. Actually, you know, some jumpings might be warranted, but we'll see yeah, how we'll, we'll, we'll figure it out. Yeah, we'll figure it out. Yeah, but how we'll do it? So how we'll do it? So how we'll do it? So how we'll do it? We'll go early down. So early we'll start. Early many random. Uh, G baby, you and me got the back to back. Um, so we'll go, we'll, we'll snake draft it, you know what I'm saying? Yeah, I like yeah. that. I like that. We'll, like we'll snake, that. Like we'll snake, like we'll snake draft it. All right, Maybe no diddy, no I diddy. Can. My boy just said, My boy, and I got you. Hold on, my boy said, I don't, no diddy, no diddy. Come on, bro. What, what did yo, that was crazy, me? Son. yeah, earlier, earlier up. Um, I said I like a little snake draft. Oh, I didn't. I know what you said on the back end. My bad. My bad. Oh, we, like, we, we 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 get to pick who we want, right? Nah. Yeah, yeah, pick a receiver. Pick a receiver. Brandon so, Ayuk, the top of tier two. There you go. Oh, we get to pick a receiver. We get to pick. Yeah. Oh, we about to start. Camping. Oh, yeah, yeah. Okay. yeah. Okay. 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 Man. Oh, it's my turn. Uh, yeah, Is this so assuming man, everybody's healthy? Uh, yeah, so this was updated. This playlist, this was um, this template was updated uh, actually January 2024. Oh, so this is pretty fairly new. Okay, perfect. Man, everybody yeah, helps. Perfect. Stay Yo, man, is yeah. about to be nasty <laughs> as hell, bro. Yo, Manny, Manny, go ahead. Manny don't steal oh, one. Don't Go ahead, Manny. Hey, Manny's nasty. Kick that overfield, nigga. <laughs> <laughs> my mother. <laughs> <laughs> I upgrade. I get busy. Uh, oh give me, give me t- scary Terry. Okay. Oh, okay. Okay. And where you want him? Top of tier one. I ain't mad at it. I, I ain't mad at it. But he gonna drop down. We know that. Oh yeah, yeah. most definitely. He most definitely. <laughs> most <laughs> definitely. <laughs> Scroll down for me, uh, J Rock. Yeah, because that's that's ridiculous already. <laughs> um, I got I got a box of scary Terry uh, Frosty Flakes. Yeah, Manny, that's I ain't gonna lie, Manny, that's strike one. But we're gonna no, be how is that strike one? Yeah, are you tripping? You tripping? You tripping? You tripping? Give me Puka. Give me Puka. J Rob, Puka at the top of tier three. Top of Puka. tier three. Like okay, it. I like it. I like it. I like right. it. Oh, like right, you're right. You're right. I, I just feel it. like I just feel like you could have put my, that man in tier two with Ayuk. I think they're in the same all area right, right so, now. That's what my that was all right, my so me now. No, because he's, he's he. But, I wanted one more year, J. Rob. I'm I, no, I, was, I was talking I'm to Manny. Gonna, I was talking to Manny. Go ahead. Okay, go it's, ahead on, it's on me, right? Yeah. Put him on round tier three. Ayuk was gonna be in tier one. I'm on Rod tier three. Oh my god! Is he above the these above wide receivers, bro. They just the fourth right, row right, down. Right, right, there you right, go. Right. You can put them on. You can put them on top of Puka if you want. I don't care. That's you have to, like, come on. Like, uh, wow, that's so, insane. All right, man. So, so all right, talk right, about right, receivers. Man, man, Trent, hey, Trent, I didn't think he was going stupid. there, but man, he's a tier three receiver. Like, I don't see the issue. Like yeah, cool, cool, cool. Yeah, let's get nasty. He's not. 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 He Oh, where you gonna put him? Where you gonna put him? He said, if no, we said everybody healthy, though. You can't tell everybody healthy. No, I'm saying, I'm, I'm saying injury history, injury history. I'm just saying it slowed him down. It slowed him oh down. Oh my uh, god, so put him in between Ama and Puka. Okay, bro. Oh, no, no, there's no way. One mic, one mic, one mic, one mic, one mic, bro. There's no way, bro. There's no way, bro. There's no way, bro. There's no way, bro. Go ahead, go ahead. Five games next year. Don't come crying to me. 
You said well, you, you, if healthy, now you're changing I, it. I swear, we don't keep that same energy with other positions. Yeah, like, yeah, yeah. Oh, yeah, 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 Pick your guy. Damn, y'all. Go ahead. Go ahead um, all right, I'm going to pick. I'm going to I'm going to. You know what? I'll pick Jamar Chase. Jamar. Nice and safe. Just how nice. Jamar. Yeah, and I, I said receivers. this. Next year, he can be right in that conversation for being number one. I'm be honest. Oh, yeah. Next year, oh, I'm expecting Jamar Chase. Well, he's a he's a Bob's character. Flip that, flip that. Yeah. Flip that. <laughs> I think for sure. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Jamar yeah, Chase yeah. breakout gonna go crazy. I'm be honest. All right, uh, Jalen Carter. Jenica. Let's go with Stephon Diggs since we're talking about him. Okay. And we're gonna put him right in up top. Up top, Jamar. Up top. Up top. Up top. Okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. top. We're gonna do Stephon Diggs at the top of tier two. What the fuck? I'm gonna, wait, I don't wait. I don't think Terry McLaurin like is tier it. one though. What the fuck? I, 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 I think like it. Bro, this is the shit I'm talking about, bro. I what think is it's top tier yes, two? Tier one is, is, is the top of tier hey, two. Man. I ain't gonna lie. I ain't gonna lie, Trent. Trent, stop talking, bro. bro you could. You put. Trent, stop, I'm really. Trent. I'm really. The I, I ain't gonna lie, Trent. Trent, 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 I ain't gonna lie. Don't, 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 don't gaslight us, nigga. You just put. Yeah. You put Amon Ra. Diggs is way better than Amon Ra. And you yeah, He's way better than him. What niggas is pink? I, I, and I, you still I, wearing I, the Don's hat when your when your family live in Tampa? Shut up, nigga. I got a question. Pick my average on your next pick, nigga. Not with my average on next pick, nigga. That's what you talking about, Yeah, I'm with you, man. I'm with you, man. I don't know. I don't know, Bama. I don't lost know. Lost me. Lost me. I'm I'm fine with I'm fine. I'm not talking about what Jalen said. I'm talking about Trent trying to tell everybody they yapping what he just did with this armor shit. Because yeah, go ahead, go ahead, go ahead, go ahead, G. Go ahead, G. Go ahead, G. Bro, it's your pen. Go ahead. It's oh, good. it's on me. I ain't so, uh, I'm I'm finna violate now. I don't care. Give me Debo, please. We not uh, come on, don't start going to dump. No, 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 why? Wow. All right, bro. All right. I don't want to do this. I mean, anymore. I mean, because immediately y'all get nasty. We only bro. got four tiers. Is that really crazy? Yep. Oh, <laughs> I was doing it like top five is tier no, one. No, right? DK yeah, is a yeah, yeah. Uh, no, it's good. It's good. It's good. Hey, it's good. It's top ten. It's good. It's good. So I, I got the I got the I got the back to back of the snake, right? So pause. Yeah. All right. So give me Calvin Ridley, and I'm gonna put him in work on your game. <laughs> and then um give me give me facts. and then um since we just since we go in there give me my dog go. right here mm. blam because he could be number one too since i think he could be a number one receiver i'm taking him over fucking oh, we doing projections? no i'm just being nasty nah but i'm gonna put this, him right here oh yeah no, this, nasty, oh, yeah, no i respect you right. but j-rob that's not wrong j-rob that's not wrong. i think i think Garrett, but i do but i do generally think gary's better than everybody up here except jamar Oh, yeah, oh that's Diggs, a fact. too? That's a fact. That's a fact. Diggs, that's too? Fact. He's better than Diggs. He's, he's better than Diggs. He's not better than Diggs. He's better than Diggs. Nah, let's stand on it. I, I can be. I ain't gonna lie. I want you to understand if Diggs, if Diggs had, if Diggs had a uh, Garrett Wilson situation in New York Jets, bro, he would have put an Antonio Brown. Stop, bro. Stop. 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 Early, I'm with you. Early, I'm with you. Early, I'm with you. I'm with you. I hate that. I think I think he better. He is nice as hell in Madden. I ain't going. Madden, he's different. I ain't going. He's different. He's different than Madden. No, the Rams would take DK over Cooper Cup right the fuck now, bro. Any day. Any day. You're drunk as hell. Yeah, he already has. Hold on, wait a minute. They got Luka does the same thing and he's younger. Why would I want thirty? All right, bro. Luka does the same thing and he's younger. Oh, okay. Hey. You know what? I wasn't right, go ahead, gonna, G, hey, baby. Go ahead, I wasn't going to do it. I wasn't going to do it, but just based off that statement, put Debo in front of DK Metcalf, please. All right, right bro, in front of DK I want to call Since you out. Since we doing that now. But it's not crazy. This is going to be the nastiest wide receiver. That's not crazy, though. Yeah, we're going to be worse than Riddell's worst. Y'all some, y'all some, y'all some. I'm hating ass. Bro, this list is crazy. hearted ass niggas, man. Go ahead, go ahead, Jalen. Sad niggas, man. It's just this. Yeah. Let's take let's take AJ Brown. Oh my God, you took mine. And put him right. Let's put him right behind Jamar Chase. You lost me. Number two, right I'm behind. Fine with that. Yeah, I'm fine with that. I'm not fine with that. 
Um, <laughs> you know what? Let's get. I mean, how, how did that lose you, my nigga? Not actually, you're not you know better what? than I'm, him. In your opinion, nigga, how did this, what has this nigga been doing in the league, bro? Are you can? Are you are you blind, bro? Are you blind, bro? Like, what are we talking about? If this list is purely going to be strictly in, I just think he's better than him, or we're not going to. No, but we can explain. I can explain to you why he's better than AJ Brown. My nigga, my nigga. Some of this shit, but at the end of the day, you think it is crazy that he's behind Jamar Chase on this list? Nah. Why? How the fuck is that crazy, Manny? I just think because he's not in the wrong spot, bro. Strike, strike, strike two. Go ahead, Jalen. Get his ass out of here. You went with Jalen. Jalen, you did AJ Brown. Yeah, I did AJ Brown. Yeah. All right, go ahead. Go ahead. Uh, go ahead, Riddell. Yeah, I want to project a little bit too. Give me Drake London. He bought mm. Oh no! Nah. Be nasty. <laughs> I'm not mad. Give me at my that. dog. Give me my dog, Drake London. He's right on top. Top. Oh shit! My bad. My bad. No, you good. You good. In the middle. Here we go. Right there. I'm putting this man. I ain't gonna go too crazy, but I'm expecting <laughs> tier three season. That's what I'm expecting. Mm. Give me that. I'm not a bad. Stop. I mean, he's already. You want him ahead? You want him ahead, or you want him ahead, or you want him just? No, I can't lie to myself. He's not better than any of those guys. Okay. Cool. Yeah. Smooth. Smooth. Uh Lonnie. Sorry, I gotta just go back and forth. I don't remember the order of the box. Uh, yeah, Lonnie. You went right. Yeah, you went right. You went right. Mm-hmm. Okay. Lonnie, cool. Lonnie. Give give me uh George Pickens. Damn, I want Ooh, I like it. I like it. You bitch ass nigga. You know that's my guy. Where uh, you gonna put him though? Cause I think I think same Omar should be in tier two. Yeah, really I think so. Mm-hmm. I think so too. Just that's put him up. behind put him behind. Put him behind him, I guess. Man, y'all. Yes. All right, bro. All right, it's on bro. Me. Go ahead. Yeah, go ahead, Trent. Just put. Oh, you know, Stefan, right? not in tier what? It's, yeah, it's tier one, top ten. Because I, I was making. We don't have enough. We don't have. We don't have new. We don't have enough tiers to just go by five, ten, fifty. It's just. Um, can you go down, Jay, bro. Go down a little bit. Mm-hmm. Um, keep going, keep going. Hey, just um, just grab CD and put him right behind Jamar. Oh, you bitch ass. Right. Nigga, you are so fucking lucky. <laughs> he was going to be tier three. I swear to God. <laughs> <laughs> nigga. But, but early when I talk about let's not troll today. Yeah, we're not trying to troll. We're going to make trolling. some corrections. We're going to make some corrections right, to this that, for that, sure. That, we're going we're gonna to get real with this at some point. That was Terry gonna... above. Are right, we going to get real at some point? All right, All right, All right, All right we'll fix it later then. Yeah, yeah, we'll fix the list. We'll fix this. Okay. Go ahead, Random. Uh, Give me Jacoby Myers and put him in uh tier three. Jacoby, that's my dog. Where you at? Where my slime Jacoby at? There's that guy. Uh, that might be. Mama, like, I would put him in front. I would put him in front of Drake London. Huh? That's, that's cool. Whatever. I'm, I'm, I'm gonna relax. I'm, gonna I'm not gonna. <laughs> go <before, bro>. I'm <laughs> gonna just... What? <laughs> I'm gonna yeah, I got it, bro. Y'all know. I like go, Jacoby, bro. Who do y'all think he is? Like you no, act like I'm putting him. You act like I'm putting him in tier one. Nah, I, I think y'all really sleep on Jacoby though, but I don't really think he's over. I don't think he, I don't think he over Jacoby. I don't think I mean I don't think he over Drake, but I'm not mad at him him rocking with Jacoby. I think Jacoby's nice. Grab Smith. Well, I think so too. Yeah. I think he's nice, but Drake is a dog. I think I think with a real quarterback, we would really see put what Jacoby behind. could be. I, I put him behind. Oh my god, bro. Oh, this is about to get nasty. He might get booted. Put him behind. Oh, yeah, I ain't seen nasty. Put him behind scary. Not mad at it. It's just that y'all have digs in the twos, bro. Like that shit just bothers me. That's the thing. <laughs> Who's next? Early. Oh, y'all ready for it? <laughs> Scroll up. Scroll up. Scroll up. Scroll up. He's not. He's not taking this shit serious, bro. Wait, you Scroll you don't up. think Sweeney's a tier one receiver? No. 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 He's no. Not. He's no. Not. He's not. He is not a yeah, tier exactly. one receiver. What about y'all? About? Come on, y'all. He's not. He's not. He's not. No, he's not two tier one receivers on the Eagles, y'all. I just. I just feel like. I just feel like. I just feel like I just feel like we're not I just feel like we're not we're not being real with our continuity right now. Go ahead early. Go ahead. Scroll early. up, scroll up, scroll up early. You 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 come for what I love, come what you love. Scroll up, scroll up. Give me that bitch ass nigga tank Dale. Come here, tank. Come here, tank. <laughs> Sit your ass on third behind Wait. Puka. <laughs> yeah, so third tier behind Puka. Where's Tank? I can't find him. Oh, right there. You right see his there, hair. Yeah. He's right there. Uh-huh. And then I, I got I, I'm double, I'm double toppy. Pause. Come down, go back. I was speaking out of tier scroll one. Up, scroll up, scroll up, man. We ain't nobody talking to you. Scroll up, scroll up, scroll up. Uh, go, keep, keep scrolling. Let me see. Uh, I think he means down, Jay. Ooh, yeah, they're down. Oh, scroll yeah. down, scroll down. Let me, right, see, let me 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 see. Who the fuck do I want? These niggas are so small. Uh, 
Give me, mm, give me Jettis. Give me Jettis. Put him up. Take him, take him, take him, take him. And put his ass to where he belongs. Yeah, you ain't got to worry about it. Yeah. yeah. Put him where he belongs. I know. Facts. Facts. Who's, uh, come on. Come on, Random. All right. No, let's just get out the way. Put, put, uh, Devonta Adams in tier one because this is fucking doing now. Yeah, I I personally believe so. uh, I put him at the top of tier one. Mm. Number one, yeah, I think he's the best receiver in the league. Yes, sir. I'm not mad at yeah, it. I'm not mad at it. Yes, sir. You know how I feel about Mr. Mm-hmm. Mr. 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 Picasso. Mr. Picasso. The I like it. What's that? What's that mean? I like it, Picasso. Yeah, that's mm-hmm. y'all out of your mind for real, for real. But that's cool. We'll see. Uh, I mean, yeah, I man. disagree, but I'm okay. not. Mad. Go ahead. Go ahead hey, he's so go good. Ahead. He got a Taco Bell in his crib. What are we talking about? <laughs> Mr. Picasso, go ahead, Trent. Oh, it's on me. Um, who's down here? Probably why he fell off. All them crunch wraps. That's crazy. That's crazy. Come on. Early not wrong, though. He might not be wrong. Keep going down, J Rope. Keep going down. Keep going down. And Mr. Early ain't Morley. Let me get my cameras. Yeah, yeah. Don't violate. Yeah. Let me put Mike. You bet. I will be smack you in real life. You violate. I promise. Early, I'll give you a nugget. Hey, <laughs> hey, put 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 Mike behind Tank. I shoot your big ass. <laughs> oh behind God. behind Tank. Uh, yeah. uh. <laughs> hey, you know, the amount of the amount of receivers I feel like Trent has interviewed that said Mike Evans is top five, and he's my, Yo, like, no. yo, it, yo, I'm it's the nah. disrespect to <laughs> Mike Evans is insanity, bro. I'm gonna need you to keep this exact same energy when you see him. So I just, I just want to confirm: we think Mike hey. Evans and Jacoby Myers is in the same tier. No, well, they're not. No, no. Wait, oh, oh, they're oh, not. Oh, 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 hold on, time out, time out, time out. Number one, number one, number one. Dear baby, don't pull that shit because you have DK and Debo in tier four. Hey, don't pull that because you think Brandon Ayuk and Cooper Cup are in two different tiers. I'm not trying to hear it. No, I, I, I'm not no, trying to hear it. No, no, I'm not trying to hear it. I never said that. Whoa, whoa, what did I say? I didn't say that. Bro, I said right. Brandon Ayuk. But all right, same, 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 same thing, bro. Same thing, bro. Same thing. And the other thing I want to, I just want to say this: since we, since we are being serious, I don't know about y'all, but I'm gonna take since Manny is going, I'm gonna take his ass and who want to put him in the right location. He's tier two. Yeah, he's tier two. Put the end of tier two. Bottom. And I'm putting my dog right here. I think he should be at the top. A tier two because he's so not. Tier right, two. Can we be for real now? Can we be for real now? If we're being serious, Devontae Smith needs to come down too. I I think so too. He's at the top tier two though. He's at the top. I'm I'm not mad at that. He's better than Wilson. He's not better than Wilson. What are you talking about, man? He's in tier one. Period. Please put Derek. Like nurse, no, if we're being you serious, like digs we're like digs at the top digs of the table. Whoa, whoa, in front of City Lamb, in front of City Lamb. That's, that's crazy. Chase, he's right there. Stephon Diggs. Yo, I'm fine. I'm fine. I'm fine. I'm fine. Smitty is I'm not better than Garrett Wilson. And like, no, 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 City no, no, Lamb is not better than AJ Brown. Put him at the end. He is the one. He is the one. He is. Yeah, yeah. Yo, y'all gotta understand. Listen, y'all. I'm on here too. I think I'm on Ross here too. And Cooper Cup. And Cooper Cup. Please. Amon Ra is above Devontae Smith. No, and Garrett Wilson is the one. No, he's not. No, he's not. No, he's not. He, I think, he I think is right now. Bro, I he's the lead. Bro, least. he's the I best receiver on his team, bro. Stop being yeah, a dick. What does that mean? No, of course. Come out. Come out. Come out. Hold on. Hold on. Can I say something, though? But Trent, but Trent, I do think the one But I do think the one thing you and Manny are doing that y'all got to stop that I don't really like with the list is I understand how we personally feel about these some of these guys. Like exactly. I think Garrett got, I think Garrett got top three potential. I've been on Garrett since he was out of state, but he he's not a tier one receiver yet. He got things he has to do. So I just feel like I feel like we if this was maybe off potential or something, it'd be different conversations. Like why tier one? The reason why like like, like Mike is, Evans, like Mike Evans is I'm a model and model and consistency. We got him as a tier three receiver. Like I don't understand that. This, this will hear me on this is what I'm saying. Well, number one, I don't think Mike is better than none of these niggas in two tier two. That's why I think I just put him in. And number one for Garrett Wilson, this is what I say. If somebody puts him in tier one, I'm not tripping, even with the situation that he did and the reduction he has, he has the elite skill set with him to go with it. It'll be different if he was just like his talent is through the roof, but he, yeah. we haven't seen it. We know what Garrett Wilson is, so I'm not. But do we think? Do, but do we think? But you was feel, you felt that you you doubled down when we put Scary Terry in tier one. You thought it was it made sense. To I don't. Him. Yeah, I don't think it's. I think he's the back. I think. I think. I think he has a great. I think he has great talent. I think he has. 
I think he has great talent, can be tier one, but it hasn't it's all culminated to tier one. Bro. I think you Trent doesn't care about production at all. There's bro. no way Brandon IU and, 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 and Amar Ross right. right. Brown are in the top of tier two, uh-huh. y'all. There's no way, bro. You are, this word, that's why I say you are a fucking stat geek because majority of guys in the top one and top two have great production. So what are we yeah, a lot of these about? Listen, Garrett, a lot of these guys have has like so what are we max about? 1100 yards receiving. We talk there's yeah, that. Yeah, 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 yeah. you were stat geek because when you look at the situation and what he did it was still great. As of right now, okay, let's come back. 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 One mic. One mic. One mic. One mic. Who is it? Lonnie, is it your turn? Trent, you went, right? Yeah, I went. I'll put Mike. Go ahead, Lonnie. Uh, give me a Hopkins and put him in the top of tier three. No, what? Wait, actually, let me see tier three. Actually, but you can put him behind. No, I can't lie. Me and Cave for D Hop, I'm not gonna lie. I'm not mad at that at all. I'm not mad at it. No, nah, if you're gonna make yeah, it, he's a link tier three. Can I ask you a question? Can I ask you a question? D Hop, D Hop, not better than than these these three like he's not better than you no nah, he's not better than you now nah, you got no not better than at no, least like no 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 Hold on, Chan, 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 Chan. We got to get back to the list. Right, go ahead, right. go ahead, go ahead, Riddell. Um, give me Nico Collins, my boy. Come Let's on. get it, my dog Nico. I'm rocking with Nico. We're cuz uh, up, up a little bit. We're cuz at right founding. Yeah, yeah. Nico Collins. I'm gonna be realistic. He's tier three. Um, I mean, I'll put I'll put him. Above picking, Puka should be high. I think Puka should be higher. He's top of tier three. But I think Puka should be a tier two, to be honest. You think Nico, Nico Collins put up 11, hot, 1100 with Pickens? nothing, bro? You think Nico Collins is better than Tank and George Pickens? I think Puka should be higher. Tank, I just need to see more from Tank. That's what I, Do you I, think, I, think one, I think. I think it's one. I think I think it's one A, one A. I think it's one A, one A. Wait, wait, wait. I just want you to know. I just want you to know. If we're going to overvalue, if we're going to overvalue. George Pickens is number one and number three, then, dog. That's the best team on three. three. If we're going to overvalue potential, y'all, this man right here could be 10 2. He could be in 10 2. Like, bro, he's the most, this guy right here, the most physically what, like, talented. But how but is like, he, what I don't, I don't, I don't understand how Nico's that high personally. I don't, I don't know either. I, don't, I, I swear to God. I where do you want to put him? Where do you want me to put him? Where, really where, where should Look, he go? Behind like, Mike Evans. Thank you. I was about to say, like, real talk. Like, Thank okay, you. Okay, where did you go? Okay, I'm fine with that. I'm fine with that. Fine with that. Listen, all these guys have been relatively productive, and some of them despite their situations. Um, can we be this, honest? Can we be honest? Can we please? I'm gonna be real with y'all, and, I, and I'm not even the biggest fan, but I'm just being honest how good this nigga is. Garrett Wilson is at the end of tier one, dog. Please get him out of here. Get him out of here. He's better than these tier two niggas. I'm sorry. He's better. He's the number one for real. One yet. He's the number one. No, he's the number one for real. Get him look better than Devonte Smith to me. Clearly, clearly. I think Devontae's tier two though. Like, Devontae's tier two. Yeah, Devontae's tier two. But Devonte is not better than Ayuk or or Brown, bro. I'm just being honest with y'all. I know. Really? And I know Riddell really? said like at most he had 1100 yards. Devontae Adams at the top of tier one had like 1,200 with no quarterback, too. So it's that's like, what I'm saying, bro. Like, what do you mean? Shit. He's tier three. Shit. I mean, people listen, listen, I, listen I'm, I'm high on G, but I'll leave G that's in the top of tier two. If we think... been for real, tier two should be Garrett Wilson. It should be Brown or IU, either one you want to put, and then Devontae Adams. Wow. Right who, who, I mean, Deontay Brown? Deontay Hawkins, I mean. Deontay Hawkins. Right Ross St. Brown, guys. I'm on oh, Ross St. Yeah, like, Brown. Come on. Saint Brown, that's his last name, y'all. But all, I'm going to say this. For Tier 1, if I don't think he's they're better than Garrett, they cannot be Tier 1. Because I think this is the threshold. Like, I think Garrett is the threshold, for real. That's fine. Oh, saying, yeah, but but Hawkins is better than Cooper Cup. And, uh, and, because and I think we all oh, agree, Garrett. I think I think if the Andre Hawkins had Matthew man, Stafford, man. what would he be, Trent? Oh, I'm not gonna lie, bro. Shut up, bro. bro. I'm not gonna lie early, early. One thing, bro, shut up with like you being such a bot when you talk about receivers and how you talk about D Hop. We are in 2024. This is the one thing I'll give it to G Baby. He was right. D Hop is not the same anymore. He's still good, but he ain't the same yeah. receiver. So, yeah. like, bro, like Nick, my D-Hop, nigga, bro. my nigga, what with 1100 yards and stop oh, oh, watching you being a stat geek? Watch yeah. the film, watch the tape. I'm sick of y'all niggas be stout. Love me, love me, door. Nigga, watch him. He's not the same. My receiver. nigga, you had the bro. You was cool with Adams being in the tier one, damn man. What are you talking about? Watch the tape, nigga. The nigga who, when he was the number one, he dropped passes. Shut what up. What are you talking about? About who? 
Adam, Adam, Smitty, Smitty, the, the fake Smitty, not, not the one who went to Carolina. Okay, well, all right, hold on, y'all. But y'all, we still gotta get through the list. Yeah, we gotta keep going. Yeah, yeah. We got so many names. Yeah. yeah, come on, bro. There's some names. Like, I'm gonna do uh, uh, Michael. You a terrified tight end, nigga? Shut up. What are you talking about, bro? Go ahead, go ahead, Jalen. Uh, Michael Thomas, Michael Thomas. I know you've been a lot. Yeah, MT, MT. You, you gotta work on your game. You gotta work on your game. Why are we ranking Michael Thomas? Work on your game. Go ahead, go ahead, go ahead, uh, G. Um. All right. Now that we fixed the list, and I don't, I'm not spiteful anymore. Um. Give me Keenan Allen. Ball head. Tier two. Tier two. Tier two. Tier two. Yeah. He. He. The top. Honestly, in front of D Hop. What and see, because I believe because okay, so yeah, have, it, no, 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 it, hold up, hold up. Before everybody goes crazy, hold up. Well, that, before oh, wait, everybody wait, goes crazy, wait. let me ask this question: Are we injury taxing or are we not injury taxing? He coming off I'm, his best season. Well, he though, he is season. coming off his best season, but I'm asking in that <laughs> offense, in that offense that they was running up there. I mean, gee, I mean, not to mention who does he play for now? I'm asking who does he play for now? The the only reason I'm asking is because I still believe if we're not he does play for the Bears and they should they should be better with Caleb but nevertheless the only reason I'm asking because I think Keenan Allen it's because the Cooper Cup thing is messing me up I think if they're both healthy I don't think Keenan Allen's better than Cooper Cup but if we're gonna tax Cup I'll move Keenan up that's why I'm asking I I, I put everything into perspective so the fact that Cooper hasn't been able to stay healthy consistently. Is like ever, okay. ever, ever, really, except for the like, triple pass. Do, do, but do we think Cherry? Do we think Scary Cherry is a better number one receiver than Keenan Allen? Me personally, I mean, At Scary Cherry. Too high, I mean, and what, I, and what I mean by error is not it's not about season ending. I mean, Cooper just been hurt. He been injured at some point almost every season of his career. No, yeah, you're right, Jay Rob. That's why I'm injured. That's why I'm Nigga, if we be honest right now, Cup should be behind Puka. Nigga, Puka the new number one over there. Like, I want to know that. No, no, no. Moving forward, <laughs> unless he goes to another team. No, well, so so fine. Move Keenan in front of. Oh my bro. I mean, you can actually in between, right there, right there is fine. Okay, okay. Yeah, I'm gonna go. I don't expect Cooper to play all seventeen whatever games. Actually, I don't. I don't expect that. Who do I want to take? Um, I want to go with a good one. Um, who, who hasn't been picked that actually? Um, you got Lave, Waddle. I, I got Tyreek Hill, I guess, but that's obvious. That's obvious, though. Um, I wish I wish Travis Kelsey was in this joint. JSN. Okay. JSN. Um, oh, is this DJ Moore? Let me get DJ Moore. Yeah. Let me get DJ Moore. This tier two to me, and I'm no, what? In. He in top of ten, a bottom of tier one? No, okay. Tier no. two? No, no, no. I don't think he better than Garrett. I don't think he better than Garrett. I don't think he better than Garrett. Mm-hmm. Um, I'm gonna put DJ. <laughs> you don't think he better than Sun uh, I just feel like I gotta. I just don't want to discredit some guy production. With, okay, y'all, yeah, just I want to the I mean, I I right put Smitty behind and put Trey space with Smitty. Like, I under, like, yo, Trey, I want you to understand. I'm very aware. I, I'm very aware that DJ Moore and Smitty need Trey spaces. No, they don't. Nah, I think <laughs> I'm gonna put him right here because I just feel like I feel like if we really feel this, I don't really feel this way about Smitty like Trent do. But I'm gonna say this I'm not gonna discredit. His production, bro. Like what I'm saying, like okay, I'm not so. going to discredit his production just because, and it's and it's not about stat watching. His production impacts wins, so I want to make like is I'm not do the same thing, huh? Yeah, I'm saying does DJ Moore not do the same thing for the Chicago? Bears? No, he doesn't. He doesn't do the same thing. Let's be real. He should like, be next to Scary you Terry. Lying like, <laughs> you lying like shit earlier. I don't know why you just lie like that. He has single handedly won games for the Chicago Bears this season. No, he, he had a he had a game we had over twenty yards. I'm wrong. Yes, they're, 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 they're next to like they, they're right next to each other. That, that's yeah, right. where he should be at. But I think Smitty, if you want me to be dead honest, how I really feel, Smitty is like, yeah, that's why I mean, I, I probably put him over IU. Thank you, for sure. Now, oh my, I'm gonna go with, I'm gonna go with, I'm gonna go with. I feel like honest, <laughs> yo, this is not bad. <laughs> if you yeah. literally just put it down, if y'all literally put out you go over him, that's it, bro. He right I'm not gonna lie, bro. early. You love to do the situation shit. If you gave if you put Smitty on the fucking Packers, he's going for 1400 and it'll change your whole opinion. Oh no, nah, he's gonna be a dog with the Packers. But if you okay, put exactly. you on the Packers, oh, we can get some crazy too. Hey. If you put hold on, let's be real. If you put yeah, I was Garrett about to Wilson, say the same logic applies you to put, I you I'm saying, that's what I'm saying. I'm if saying, you put Garrett Wilson, DJ Moore. Devontae Smith or are you on the Packers? They 
fuck he's saying. Been on the, he's been on the to, Pretty much everybody in here too. I'm no, trying no, to right. gas DK. Except for Mama. But I look at it like, but I look like this. I look at it like this though. Most of these guys in tier two, even though they're not tier one, all these guys could be number ones for a team. They are number ones. They are number ones. You know, me too. Except for Smitty. Well, Smitty's a two. <laughs> two. A solid two, but he's a two. He's a solid two. But let me get the back to back pause. I got the back to back, John. So who do we got? Who do we got for this next, John? I want to see. Uh, uh, I'm trying to think. I'm trying to leave y'all the, the better ones. I'm not trying to take all the like OD good ones. Oh. Um, Alan Lazard. Oh God! Work, work <laughs> on your game. Mm. Hey, can we do it? Hey, is that a work on your game? That that, that was me being upset. Hey, angry fan talker. Yeah. Can we do a can we do a work in that Walmart uh list just right underneath there? <laughs> oh, right under Walmart. Please, right under work on your game. Walmart. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Just say Walmart. Walmart, please. I got you. I got you. I'm gonna make it blue just for oh, that's the wrong one. Walmart. Um, got to Walmart. put a Walmart. I got you. Oh shit. I'm you tripping. Gotta put it below. Just put it below. Yeah, I'm tripping. I'm tripping. I'm tripping. I'm tripping. Make the edge on blue. That look like blue. Who's next? G baby. Yeah, I was waiting oh, for you. you can't see. Oh, you can't see. No, no, no. I know who I want. I was just waiting for you to finish. Cool. Go ahead, slide me. Go ahead, slide me, Chris Olave. Okay, we Chris got it. Old, where am I? Yeah, that's my guy. Um, I'm going to put him. In, it's. Really, really oh, I don't want to call him tier three though, but I mean, he is really. At the, I mean, you can say. It. Yeah. I mean, uh, yeah. I'm gonna put him in between Tank and Mike Evans right now. I don't want to call him tier three, but mm, I can't put him that high yet. Nah, I ain't gonna lie, you niggas are so disrespectful. To do we, hey, y'all? Do we honestly say DK Metcalf is number four? Like honestly, are we being I, I mean, I mean, I mean, I mean, if I'm if I'm keeping it above, DK got three. The exactly. only person, the only person on this list that I think DK is better than, real talk, is Jacoby. I, I'm not gonna hold you. Oh, Jacoby face. Myers, that's it. Oh, my. And I'm not gonna lie to you. I damn near might agree. And I'm a DK guy. I might agree. Go like, ahead, Drake, Jaylen. him and Drake London are a conversation. Uh, let's get uh, Odell. Odell. What are we gonna do? A good old Odell. Odell. Work on your injuries. You be, you be, yeah, yeah, I just say, work on your injuries for real. It's work on your injuries for real. Uh, I, I'm he said four. He said four. Work on your body. body. Like, All right, we know we we we'll be around four. Yeah, yeah, DK. DK's there. We'll around damn. I know right, who's who's next. Who's after him? The mighty head uh, It's my turn. Right, um, right. Let's go get uh, Christian Kirk, from the Jaguars. Bro. What? Bro. Yeah, Christian Kirk. Bro. Christian Kirk. Work I mean, on your game. After he <laughs> le- after he got injured, the Jaguars offense went downhill. I'm Plummeted. Going, absolutely downhill. So where we, where are you gonna put him right now? I think you know. he's. Well, I don't think DK and Debo are tier four, so I'm gonna put him bottom of tier three, like behind London. Okay. Thank you. Okay. I'm okay. Cool with that. I'm cool. Okay. Yeah, DK better than Nico Collins and, and Mike Evans. All right, whatever. <laughs> what like like what you told me? What the fuck is this? A DK shown from you? Like, this Mike Evans slander is mad nasty, legit man. So I agree with you. I don't Lewis, think it's slander though. I think he's right slander, where you need to be. Nah, slander, bro. It's not 2018 no more, bro. Nah, slander. Go ahead. Go ahead, uh, Lonnie. Uh, <laughs> give me, give me Michael Pittman. Michael Pittman. Michael Pittman. <laughs> what nah, you got to tell? Nah, this is gonna be interesting. Cause I'm, oh, I'm, it is, cause like Michael Pittman, all right though. I yeah, yeah. Yeah, all right. Yeah, all right. That nigga, all right. Like, come on, right. Friend. He's all right. Yeah, like, yeah, put him at the top of tier four. Put him at the top. He's super high. Okay, I like that. I like that. Top of tier right, four. Good job, buddy. Good job, buddy. All right, all right. So, bro, get what? back on me. Um, Gabe Davis. Yeah, oh no, Gabe Davis. He will be the first inductee to the Walmart. Oh my Damn, God. bro! He got yeah, another job. Oh, he's That's a he's the Jackson Jacksonville. Like, Alan Lazard there with him. Like had like hey, a hey, 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 hey! Yeah, Lazard, Lazard, Walmart. He's Jacksonville's third best receiver. Okay, he'll be fine. Y'all sleeping on Gabe? Lazard's Walmart yeah, though. Sleep. Yo, J. Rock got it. Y'all sleep on y'all sleep on Gabe. That's a good number two. No, right, that's me, a good number three, which is what he will be on. That's fine. Line. That's fine. He's going to have 800 yards as a three. That's good production. That go is. Ahead. I'm saying. That's, that's that was right here, baby. That's that was great production. Uh, go ahead, uh, Trent. He oh, just oh, ran. Oh, I'm, bug- I'm bugging random. Sorry. Sorry. Uh, let me get Jordan Addison and put him in tier three. Oh, I like nice, that. Nice, but where? Yeah, where, where scroll up that? a bit. Um, 
I put him. Um, he better than Nico, bro. He better than Mike. Yeah, <laughs> I put I put I put him I put him right behind Tank. Yeah, I put him right there behind Tank. Okay. Yeah, he better than Olave cool too. Yeah, I'm cool with that. I'm cool with that. I'm cool with that. I'm cool with that. As long as we get DK and three, dog, I'm cool. So far, listen, all right to me. Go go ahead, go ahead, Rand. Uh early, you got the double. You got the double. You got the know back to back. That's me. Oh, yeah, right. it's you, it's you, it's you. No, right. it's you early, it's you. All right, bet. You got it. So, first of all, can we put a Lazar in Walmart, though? I'm, I'm with y'all on that. Lazar got to be at Walmart. But I ain't one of mine. Kadarius Tony, big Walmart. <laughs> the yeah, biggest one. Up here. Oh, he <laughs> don't even up got there. him up here. He's not even up here. He's not, not even, even the biggest. Team. Shout out to Justin Watson one time. All right, let me get let me get Adam Thielen. Yo. Aileen. 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 Hey, that's my guy, though. Don't do my don't now. Do. Let me get him. Come on, slide up a little bit, a little, little bit more, a little bit more, a little bit more. Give me him above. I need him over Jacoby. Yo, can we, can we kick him? I'm cool. Man. You can, hey, hey, can we kick him? <laughs> <laughs> we really about to say with a straight face, I don't think better than Drake London. He put up a level. Oh, I don't the, think Drake London should be that low, to be fair. But Jacoby has never had a good. I don't think I don't. Jacoby should not be above. Bro. If we doing that argument, bro, Terry McLaurin is all right. Yeah, yeah, that's why. Yeah, we do. Garrett Wilson. I got Adam. Oh, no, whoa, 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 whoa. We tried Adam. Adam. What about Terry? What about Terry? What about Terry? I'm saying, if we're going to use these QB arguments, bro, Terry is right behind Garrett Wilson. Garrett is also, yeah, Garrett will. Which I think he is. We're doing a QB argument. Early. I wouldn't be mad at that at all if you put Terry behind Garrett. All right, my second one, let me get. That's a lot of niggas I can't recognize the face because they're so small. Uh, oh, let me get my boy, uh, Mr. Cooper. Hanging with Mr. Cooper. Amari. Amari, Amari Cooper. Cooper. Where's Amari? Oh, found you. Amari. So, Amari is. Be respectful. Come on. I think he's very even... into tier two. Huh? All right, but y'all talking. You think Amari Cooper is a tier three receiver? No, I think he's tier two. Into tier two. I'm talking about Trent. You think he's tier three? No, at the oh. end of tier two. My... All right, I got it. Oh, you think it should be higher? Or no, no, no. I think it should be above. I think it should be. You know what's crazy? Trent is. 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 Trent I was about to say he's only gonna move him up two spots because he thinks Brandon Ayuk is better. Where do you think he's gonna go? I'm not gonna lie. He thinks Brandon Ayuk is better, so why is he tripping? He's only gonna move him up two spots. Yeah, not gonna lie. That's really. I I think I'm. I'm And I ain't taking Cooper up with Curry McCurn. I'm not. Well, well, yeah, no, I'm not gonna lie. Yeah, like so he's moving up two spots. Nah, I'll probably I'll pull him a little higher. You? How much higher? No, 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 Trent, no, no, no. you I think literally just you. yelled but, at me you for think thinking Amari Cooper is better than Brandon Ayuk. I'd put him over Ayuk. Oh, 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 but you, I'm talking about you. Know who I think is well, not for sure, but I'm talking about you. Too, like, it's a conversation. So it'll be like three spots, three, four spots. That's what so I'm you saying. think he? So you think t- Terry better than all three of these boys up here? Yes, I think he's the only person not better than Garrett. I would. Then we got to put we got to put more above Maron. No offense to Maron, love Maron. All right, I'm fine with that. Then we could put. Ayuk is over Cooper. Come on, y'all. No, he 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 clears him. Yeah, he, he's over Cooper. Yeah, no, he doesn't. Um, and he over Smitty. And he over Smitty right now. All right, so if we make it one more correction, I gotta make one correction myself. Come on, y'all. Let's let's not disrespect. <laughs> we we him can give guy. the Madden merch some grace. We give him some grace. Yeah, yeah. let's give him some grace, bro. Give him some grace. Give him let's give him some real grace. Real grace. No, 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 J-Rob, you can put him right behind Mike Evans if you want to give him some grace. I was about to say, put him behind Mike Evans. Yeah, can we be – okay, guys, 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 guys. With DK Metcalf's – hold up, y'all. With DK Metcalf's productivity, with motherfucking Geno Smith, a quarterback, dog, who low-key don't be seeing him sometimes, and he be open. Why don't we like DK? Why don't we like DK for real, y'all? For real. For real. For real. For real. Yeah, I, I think, think, think we should be a bum. Who do y'all think the Kalian Metcalf is? I'm going to tell you why I like the Kalian. I'm going to tell you why I like the Kalian Metcalf, because honestly, yo – Trent, I would just watch him work on his game. Thank you, J-Rose! You know? like, I respect it. I respect it. Yo, you know, his he did. He worked on his hands. His work was on his hands. Yo, 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 they put him in the slot now. Stop but it. What I'm saying, but what I'm saying is, for a guy who is natural, bro, he is naturally stiff body, bro. Like, he can't help that. 
And I gotta give him credit for really working against his weaknesses. But I'm okay. Okay, we'll we'll we'll, we'll put him right under Evans. All right, who's next? Is I it early? Is it, is it random now? Random. random. Okay, Randy, who you got? I know you got. he can play with a better quarterback. He'd be 1,500 yards, man. Just like Terry McCormick. say that about a lot of people. He just them. Um, you know it wouldn't look as good, put, though. Put Rasheed Rice <laughs> yeah, he got it, bro. at the end of Tier 4. <laughs> it wouldn't be. It wouldn't be. Yeah, he needs to be in Walmart. In he it wouldn't be. 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 It wouldn't That's what he needs to do. Yeah, UK is his, Terrell yeah. Owens yeah. with a good yeah. quarterback. Yeah, Rasheed Rice. Rasheed Rice. Uh, UK is Terrell Owens, guys. Come on, Rasheed. Rasheed Rice. We're gonna put you. On, we're gonna put you on work on you. No, nah, actually, we're gonna we're gonna work put Walmart you on work because that's where he's gonna be after. Because you need to you need to make. Oh yeah, that, that, that's a felony, bro. Walking away from an accident, brother. Yeah, felony, that's crazy. Bro. So he's gonna be spending for a good minute. So stupid. And he was renting that uh that Lambo, and he had his family driving it, which is back on me. Yeah, so stupid. Work on your game, Rasheed. That was ridiculous. Come on, you know what? Grab Reek and put him behind um Jettis. Mm-hmm. Can we be for real? Can we be for real? Nah, nah, that, is, for real, is, that is for real. That's no, for real. That's for real. That nigga's behind Jamar Chase. I'm not Jamar mad at that either, though. No. I'm not going to hold you. I'm not I mad mean, at I'm not going to volley where I really wanted to put Reek. Hey, y'all. Uh, yeah. Guys, yeah, we yeah, have a conversation, right, bro. Right. That's how right. now to me, to me, this bro. this to me, this looks better. To me, this yeah, looks better. It doesn't better. Better. It does. yeah, better. I think that, better. Thank you, thank you, thank you. That burst of press, but these yes, three, ooh, ooh. 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 these three, honestly, no, I don't, I honestly don't think he's better than these three yeah. I, at all. At all, AJ Brown, that nigga went fast minutes. as an actual cheetah, bro. That a nigga, lot, ooh, boy. I, I, okay, yeah, I got it. Go ahead. Oh, you talking about who's next? Who's next? Oh, it's on. It's Lonnie. Lonnie. Uh, we talking about pure receivers, Trent. If it's pure receivers, that's mind. crazy. So why do y'all? Never mind. Never oh, mind. Never mind. Okay. Never mind. Never mind. Never mind. Never mind. Never that's basically mind. why is DK getting grace for pure receiver. Give me right. and, and why were y'all violating uh, yeah, me when he... I put Debo there? Pause. Violate what? Debo deserved to be a tip over. I didn't, I didn't violate you about Debo. Yeah. And, and for real, for Odell over Debo. What are we talking about? Debo I feel like you can. I feel like we can go. I feel like we can go. Oh, they're the top of tier four. If anything, I feel like I feel like when you do a tier, this is a combination of things, fellas. So let's just let's stop yeah. acting like it's one criteria. You two no, fucking, you're right, you're right. you two fucking dinglings trying to be whatever y'all doing, weirdos. Go ahead, go ahead. Can I get Jason. Um, that's not, like look for that. Yeah, you go. Yeah, put him above Thielen. That boy's super light skin. What has he done to be above Thielen? Might as well, might as well put him above DK. That what I'm oh. thank you, y'all, for at least giving Thielen some love, man. <laughs> okay, so question. You might as well put him above oh, DK too. So, okay, question, bro. Question. Like, if oh, my question is this though: like, did, like, did he not ball out last yeah. year? Did yeah, how is he in tier three right now? Like, like, how? I don't think he is, but how? if you're gonna put him there, he's not. Right. He's in tier four. Like, he, he, he's not Ohio State no more. We, he, like, we, we, like, I get it. He has talent. I get it. He has a lot of talent that we want to see, but bro, he ain't this shit. That's and don't crazy. nobody think Jazz said better than DK. He ain't getting more passes yeah, than him. Come on, come on. Yeah. Now y'all dragging it, bro. I didn't say better than DK. Like, no, but like, my point was if you're gonna put him there, you might as well put him above DK. That's the point. All right, who we got next on the on the on the docket? Who's next? Me. He scrolled down on. a little bit. Yeah. All right, we got we're getting we're reaching some uh interesting names. I guess I can grab uh I can grab Jalen Waddle. It's gonna be interesting. Jalen Waddle, I'll put <laughs> tier three. I, I knew it, I knew it, I and knew it. I'll put him <laughs> uh, I knew he was gonna do that. I put him above Olave. I ain't gonna lie, Waddle do got Shelby more. I'm sorry. Oh, whoa. I'm not gonna lie, you, you might as well just more. put him below Olave. I ain't gonna lie. That's how you feel about yeah, you might as well. You what? should fight below Mike Evans. Goddamn. Wait, what, why are you why are you picking for me? The fuck? I didn't say <laughs> I didn't say below Olave. I didn't say below Mike Evans. I said above Olave. That's what I was. I was just I was just, I was just being yeah. a Saints fan. Go ahead, Jalen. Go ahead, Jalen. Is Gabe Davis in there? Not, he's already at Walmart. He's already clocked in. He already clocked uh, in. Let's do DJ Moore. He's already, he's already here. Oh, I'm tripping. Keep going down. Yeah. Let's go down the list. Uh, what's kind of tough? Tyler, Tyler Lockett, Juwan. Okay, Jimmy. yeah. Let's do, let's do Tyler Lockett. Tyler Lockett. He's gonna be in tier. Ooh, it could be bottom of tier three or tier four. Two. Ooh, you know what? Bottom of tier tier three. Bottom of tier. Oh, no, 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 no. Not bottom of tier three. Is he better than? No, he's he better not. than. Is he better than Thielen at this point? No, he's not. Put it right behind Thielen. Right behind Thielen. Right behind him, I guess. Yeah, I feel bad for Drink London because he just mm. Desmond Ritter, baby. Um, go ahead, uh, G. 
Um, so Jayla Waddle got picked because that's where I was gonna go next. So let me you see. Got, you got don't forget T Higgins is still on the oh on yeah, the yeah, 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 yeah. T Higgins is my one. Go ahead, slime me T. Where you want to put T? Uh he's tier two. I just think he was I agree. Jamar. I agree. I agree. Where will we put him in tier two? I'm gonna be honest, he better than this nigga, but we ain't gonna talk about Put him hey, I'm not gonna lie. Devontae, Devontae, early. Devontae. Hey, I'm not gonna lie. Put him right. You know what? I'm not trolling, bro. Put him it's in front of Keenan Allen pick. too. It's your pick. Put him in front of Keenan Allen too, man. It's, it's your put pick, bro. Keenan what do you too, want him, G? Baby, I, I want T Higgins right there, yeah, right behind okay. him, bro. I love but do we think T Higgins better than Brandon you? We are trolling. I do actually. I do. I like T Higgins. Hell no. I like T Higgins. Hell no. I truly, I truly, I love T I do. I do. I like T Higgins a lot. I do. I do. Personally, oh, yeah. I, I'm, hey, look, he picked it, Trent. Don't be mad at me. Is it my I know, I know, I know G-Bot. That's, that's G-Bot. <laughs> I know G-Bot. That's crazy. <laughs> Let me see. Let me go get. Actually, I know who I need to get. Zay Jones. Bro, yeah! Yeah! If you, Zay! Put, if you don't put his Zay! ass in work on your game, bro. Nah, I'm putting <laughs> nah, he better than He better than all three of them niggas. I'm putting him right there. Mm, he better than Debo? Hey, 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 can we be no, for real, y'all? Odell is, Odell is the best duck here for nigga on that list. Oh, no, he's not. He's not. He's not in 2016. No, if you're 2016, nigga, he'd be tier one. Number yeah, two, love, nigga. Look at that. Five, five years Debo. ago. I love Debo, but Debo is a is honestly, he is a expensive, he's an expensive gadget player. He's a yeah, he's an expensive yeah. running back. What I call what I call him fancy Cordell yeah. Patterson. Put that nigga work on your game for real, for real. Also, Odell was a guy in 2021. That's not a I ain't gonna lie. Yeah, I really can't. Can't. So hey, so was gonna, Debo. What happened to Quentin Johnson? I ain't gonna, nah, I was hoping that y'all bring my dog up because he had a great underrated season. Who By any that? means, alumni. Josh Downs, Josh man. Downs. Oh yeah, Josh, Josh Downs. Downs. He's Josh nice. Downs, uh, I'm putting him in the back of tier three. All yeah, the way. That's not, that's he's better than Pittman. He better. He's better. He's not the best he's receiver on this Pittman. team. Pittman. Game. Pittman needs to move up, bro. <laughs> Pittman needs to move up. What are we? Yeah, Pittman, yeah, Pittman, yeah, Pittman at the bottom of tier three. I didn't. I didn't. Listen. Pittman at the bottom of tier three. Listen. I didn't put. If I didn't put. I didn't put. Uh, I didn't put Pittman up here, Riddell. Listen. Not J. Rob. Not fair. No, you did. I'm not gonna lie to you. Like what we happened? just said to JSN, he he's ain't at the showing back. Shit he's at the back. He's at the back. You think he's better Where's than Jason? What Chanel? you mean? My dog broke the, the the record, the rookie record for reception for the Colts. What you talking about? That's not about? saying much, gang. Then Jason do that. For, then Jason do that for Why the Seahawks. Why is it not? Why is it oh, not? Man. <laughs> Hold on. Why is it not? Nah, my dog has. Shout out by any means, bro. Always, you know that. Right, yeah, shout out by any means. Shut the fuck up, Trent. You at the back of you at the back of the. Back to tier three. No, he's in the tier four with JSA. Shout out Josh Downs. Bro. Yeah, he is though. Josh Downs is here. I'm, hey, I, that's my dog though. That's my dog though. That's my dog though. Come on, bro. Like, Man, you come get the, on, Josh. You get the Bam tax. The Bam tax put you up a tier, bro. Yeah, Bam tax get you. I'm a. I'm a. Damn, Josh. I want. He gonna snap this year. Him, Wani, Pittman. They gonna all snap. Bro. Pierce. Who so throwing the ball? Uh, AR. <laughs> AR. Okay. AR. Right. AR. Well, Go ahead. AR Go ahead, G. Oh yeah, this back on me. <laughs> Just Bama said work on your game. <laughs> chill, chill, chill. Let me, let me, let me see. We got here. Hollywood. This is gonna be the last one through, y'all. We got Hollywood. Okay, cool, 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 cool. This is everybody last pick. My bad. This Hollywood. Mm-hmm. We got Quinn Johnson, Christian Watson. You know Quinn Johnson. Uh, yo, y'all got my dog. Y'all got my dog. That's y'all got my dog. Baby Diggs is in here. That y'all don't want to give him his respect. Read. Do I want to rank my guy, Rasheed? Oh, wait, that's oh, Baby wait. Diggs. That's all Jordan Love, nigga. Stop it. Do I want to rank my <laughs> guy Rashid Shahid though? Because Shahid. Actually, actually, you know what? You know what? You know what? No, no, no. Give me Zay Flowers. Give me Zay Flowers. Give me yeah, please. Zay. Zay. Oh, come on, hey, Zay. Rashid, hey, on. Rashid Shahid, man. Hey, man. Zay, Zay had That's a better say, man. Hey, man. Zay, come on, Trent. I know I, I I'm there with you, Trent, but come on. He's not better than Tank. He ain't better. Oh, Zay ain't better than Tank or Jordan Addison. Stop that. No, 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 we can't disrespect Zay. Behind, I'm, behind, hey, it's, hey, it's between. Trent, you know, us, Trent, you behind, you know. Wait, hold on, Trent. You know we feel the same way. Hey, but Zay's not we, better than Water, though, so we can't I, do that. We're not he's not better than a lot of either. So not who put Water? Why do we put he Water? Ain't better, here? He ain't better than us. Jim Rob, only one moving names around. We need better than Addison. Addison's Addison better than Water. No, he's not. All day, every day. Nah, put Zay Flowers. 
Like Zay, Zay ain't better in front than Waddle. Of my Zay, Zay's with his peers. No, no, no. He's with his Zay peers. is better than Waddle. He's not better than Olave. He's not better than Olave, bro. 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 He's not better than Olave, I was come on, we gonna really disrespect what Zay was cooking up this season. Hey, he what, not was he <laughs> what was he cooking up? Who was he cooking up? Zay wasn't better than Mike Evans. He's not better than Olave, though. Game. Zay Flowers wasn't better than Olave, bro. So Let's Jordan Addison wasn't by himself over there cooking. So, all right, fine, fine, fine. Right. Any from any from fine. Merlin. And I mean, Addison from Merlin. I'm, 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 I'm gonna just do. I'm gonna put Zay like that. Perfect. What you mean? Put him behind Olave. No, no, no. Nah, you been nasty. No. I'm I'm like, oh, 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 what is the argument for Zay Flowers over Olave? I'm, I'm all ears. Uh, hey, watch this. Watch this. Car. <laughs> I was gonna say. I was gonna say the difference is still more the difference. Productive. The difference is a- the difference is he's a good teammate to his quarterback. <laughs> you don't. Uh, you don't. You don't show up his quarterback every damn game. All right, that's my. If that's that's my the case. Difference. Why is Stephon Diggs that? Shut the fuck up! I'm not thinking about it every fucking receiver. <laughs> well, technically, he, he ain't showed up to the out yet, so it's a fresh start. He asked me for one receiver. God damn it! <laughs> he asked for one, not everybody. Okay, 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 my boy, my boy Diggs, he's dumb nice. He can do what he want. <laughs> like, who <do> want? <laughs> hey, look. <laughs> Never mind. Let me be quiet because that's family. I'm gonna show who, Who's who's All next? Right. Who's next? Jalen. Who going uh, to go get my dude. dog Brandon Cooks? Yeah, I, got, I got Brandon Cooks. I got Brandon no, Cooks. No, I'm going to tell that Brandon nigga, Cooks. man. Brandon oh Cooks God, is going man. on tier. It, it, he's tier four. Yeah. He's tier four. He's tier four. But you know what? He might He might be ahead of Odell at this point. Oh, yeah. yeah. I think I'm he is. He is. He's yeah. better than Debo, too. Stop. Bro. <laughs> <laughs> I'm mad at it. I pray Odell have a comeback bro, season. Bro. Brandon, Brandon Cooks is about to have 10,300 yards next year. He's had a kind of underrated career. All right, who's next? Next? who's next? Who's next? Who's that? It's me. Riddell, Riddell. Riddell. A little bit. Hollywood. You got Hollywood on here. Tyler Boyd. Um, What's my son's name? He used to play for the Jets. I can't think of his name right now. Damn. Uh, Juwan Elijah Jennings. Moore. Elijah, Moore. Elijah Moore. Corey. Uh, no, no, no. Not Corey Davis. Christian Watson. My dog, Reed. Baby Diggs. Yeah, yeah. Let MVS. Get, uh, let me get Jaden. I like Jaden Reed. Uh, This man's a yak demon, by the way. Um, Maybe did. I'll put him. He has, a, he has a really good year for the Packers. He was their best receiver. Yeah, uh, by far. So I'm going to put him at the end of tier three. Cool. He better than Pittman, though, but we'll go in there, man. I'm fine with that. If you say it, Joel, go ahead. Go ahead, Lonnie. Uh, Jerry Judy, put him behind Kevin Ridley. your game. Work on, work, on <laughs> work on your game. Work on your game. Go ahead, Trent. All right, then we go down. Um, um, Mike Will is on here too. Be nice to Mike. Put Will. him in Walmart. Oh my god. I'm not a lie. The, the, the only thing I request: do not let G Baby get him, please. But um, let me get Wandale. You love get Let me get Wandale. Let me get Wandale. Let me get Wandale. Let me get Wandale. Wandale. Right there. Um, I'll put him at the. T- I ain't gonna lie. Respect. I think he's top of tier four. Yeah, I like that actually. Yeah, I'm not fine. I'm not mad at that. Um, who's next? Is that random? Random. Uh, I'd put Chris Godwin at the bottom of tier four. The Dang. bottom. Dang. Dang. Y'all would fall off this bad. Hold yeah, on, yeah. hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Think, hold on, hold on. Yeah, Come on, y'all. He didn't he, fall he off like that. Bro. Jones is better than Godwin. Right. He's, he's not better. Than wait, wait, wait. He's not better than he better. He's not better than Reed. He better than Reed. Right. He's not better. Yeah, he's not he's better. Three. He's not better. Yeah. Hey, everybody, give me a second. Give me a he's second. Not better than Jacoby or Tyler. Or yeah, I got a second. Nice one too. Come on, get to me. I got you. But, uh, no, put him in front of Thielen. I don't say we got to give some Chris Godwin. No, yeah, I'm cool. I apologize, Chris Godwin. I apologize. Game. I'm cool with that. Yeah. Go, uh, is it early? Yes, sir. All right, give me Hollywood. Co- give ahead, me Courtland. Su- fuck Hollywood. Give me Courtland Sutton. That's my dog. And let me You're get him human. at he's gonna be tier three, but he is honestly to me. I'll put court right here. No, 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 you know, 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 who? I think I think he already had on um, Walmart. Oh, never mind. He right there. Nah, he, he ain't. He ain't. He ain't. He right there in the middle. Right at the, the, the third one. The third one. Over. Over. Right there. 
Uh-uh, keep going. Right there. Oh, right there. Put his bitch ass at the bottom of work on your game. Work on your game. Hey, you gotta work on this game, young man. All right, so let me just look at the list as a whole. Let me let me he better work on this game. He wants to be the number one this year. He better work All right, on chat. All right, chat. So here's here is the first press box wide receiver tier list. Yeah, we gotta do this again. We y'all. got the quarterbacks Let's... next week. Yeah, we'll do a quarter. Yeah, we're definitely doing quarterbacks next week because this was fun. Now, nah, um, quarterbacks too easy. Let's do running backs or corners. Corners. Maybe we, maybe we could do like maybe we could do corners and running backs the same day because those might be easy to do since it's not as many. I don't think. Yes. Yeah, so, um, so with the list, I mean, ultimately, y'all, my personal first glance, I think we did. I right. if from I'm where, being where honest, honest from where it started, I don't from where it started. I, I know y'all hate Gabe Davis, bro, but he the bottom of tier four. Y'all just don't like him. He's lost, like, bro. He's he ain't that bad, bro. He no Walmart, bro. Like, I, think, he got I, think if, I think if we have to be realistic and move somebody, I'll move Gabe into like. Hey, that's If we being realistic, we have to move people up. Hey, so look, there's only like, there's only one thing I'm going to say about Gabe Davis, right? We're gonna, Debo, we'll probably have to move. If we got to be honest, we got to move Debo over DK. That's cool. Yep. Oh, whatever. That's, I'm cool with that. So, look, if we're gonna, if put, we're, I'm only gonna, I'm only going to say one thing about Gabe Davis. I put Calvin at the top of tier four. The Everybody only... else, I think, is all right. That's right. Chris, that's right. All Christian Kirk, Evan Ingram, <laughs> and Zay Jones all had their best seasons with Trevor Lawrence. I'm just saying, maybe Gabe Davis mm. can do the same. <laughs> we'll see. True. We'll I, see. I think. I think for tier one, like I just think there's a drop. But the fact he Adams, can get his job, show you he ain't that bad. After Adams, Janice, Jamar Chase, Tyreek Hill, and AJ Brown, I just think like CD and Stefan, there's a noticeable drop off. I just think like there should what? be five in tier one. I think. There I think there should be a tier one and a half, and CD, Stefan, AJ be in there. I think AJ's more tier one, but I'm not mad at that. But one, two, three, not on four, tier. five, six. But I ain't going to lie. We only got seven guys in tier Chris, one. I, put in tier I think four that's pretty damn that. good. That's just my – I mean, I'm not good. mad at it. I wouldn't – I wouldn't go like, oh, yeah, I'm so upset. I, I agree that there's a gap after – I know he had a great year, y'all, but is City Land really tier one? Yeah. There you go. You pick it. I think – I think – I think I think personally I understand what y'all are saying because I think if we were to make another tier, I think Jettas and Ad and Adams really are alone. And then Jamar will be we, the Do we think one. the Cowboys would take any of these receivers in tier one? And uh, that means CDO any receivers. There's no way yes. AJ Brown yes. is worse than yes. AJ yes. Brown is worse than CD Lamb. Is that what's saying to, 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 yes. to each other, guys? Okay. Uh, I, look, look, I think I think I think I think, I think they're actually, Rob, you was calling him PO, yeah, bro. Listen, 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 you listen. Was calling I, him PO. I don't I don't agree with that. I don't agree with that. I agree that CD Lamb, he better yak, he a better yak guy for sure than AJ. But if I had to pick between the two, I'm I'm still rocking with TO every time. Like, if it was really up to me, I didn't get A.J. Brown. So, I didn't get the point. He's a better yak guy than A.J. Brown? If, if it was up to me. And he's a better runner, for sure. Yeah, I think I think he's a better yak guy, for sure. I think A.B.'s a better, like, he's more physical. I think A.B.'s a more physical runner, easily. But I think when you talk about just moves in open field, yes, you got to get out of the CD. But if this was up to me, this was up to me, gang, I'll put in a, A.J. Hey! That boy going right here, bro. For real, for real. AJ. Honestly, oh, I'm Tyree Hill? I'm cool with that. Yes, I love AJ. I love we got to really have a conversation about Tyree Hill, bro. AJ, yo, <laughs> I I think why, AJ, hey, time out, time out, time out, time out. Early. Let's have a real conversation. Okay, early. early. What conversation do we need to have? Because you let's talk about let's talk about let's talk about let's talk about, let's talk about one thing, his hands. Very, 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 very okay. not what they should be. Let's talk about how he was against the press last year. That's like, what, you, what do you mean? Like, okay, like, I'm gonna get prime example. Okay, I'm gonna get prime example. Let me get prime example. Chris, Chris, as small as small and fast as Deshaun Jackson was, that G- nigga was nice for the press, dog. Bro, I'm not gonna lie. You I feel like y'all saw. I feel like one mic, one mic, one mic. I feel like y'all saw Lejarius Sneed put them. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's what I'm saying. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Because once Lejarius Sneed did it, team started doing it and started. No, 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 no. That was the last game of the season. I hate, I hate when y'all do that though, because y'all acting like y'all ain't been on this show. They played it twice, nigga. What about? I've been talking about AJ. I've been talking about AJ all year. I never heard you say. That's the first time I ever heard you say he's better than Reek. But I'm saying this. The to go back to a reek. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. That's yeah. that's go back to that, that's point. Fact. That's that fact. whole press. Yeah, once you see Legere Sneed T back him, I think y'all starting to drag him. And early, you are a stat nerd. You should love Tyreek Hill. You should love the no. production of Tyreek Hill. Tyreek I like Hill. I like Tyreek Hill production. That's why I give him but the benefit of the doubt. Like, I, I, I just know that Tyreek but, is a speed demon, and I respect that. I do. But at the end of the day, dog, as a pure number one receiver, these niggas are better than him. <laughs> that's not true. That's not true. Really? I think like AJ, because AJ is right, like, right, right, I think AJ, right like when we say right. like the name, I'm not trying to take the name Debo, but I'm saying like Debo. He like, has the worst hands in one, y'all. Like, the worst hands. AJ, AJ, AJ Brown, he, he takes a rock. Like, he just, yeah. he played bully. 
He played like bully ball, but in football. That's why I really rock with his game. Yeah, AJ's like, behind Chase. How you had him, bro? I'll be honest with you. AJ yeah. behind Chase. I'm gonna let it, I'm gonna let it rock because he did have a better season overall. So I'm gonna let him rock. I'm gonna let him rock. I ain't finna fight it. I thought this was a good listen. We're not going really ever really. And fully I love the Bonte, but Jettis the best receiver in the NFL. Period. <laughs> period. That's right. Jettis Does anybody want to change Jettis? Does everybody? I, I would. Think I would might, this nigga might do Randy Moore. I mean Jerry Rice numbers. I'm sorry. <laughs> yes, I, exactly. I'll change that one because I agree with. I think he is definitely mm-hmm. deserves to be number one. Um. With that being said, though, chat, we appreciate y'all for coming to our show, fellas. Uh. Anything y'all want to say on the way out? This was a good show. Big numbers, good views. WrestleMania weekend. WrestleMania oh, weekend is the story, man. Mm-hmm. Y'all gonna see me at WrestleMania? Story. WrestleMania weekend. <laughs> we gonna be seeing a uh, Trent's shocked face when when Roman Reigns story. loses. Story. Screw the story. We finishing the story. Nah, I'm not gonna lie. I'm not gonna lie. I might. I might have. To when the Rock costs him and 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 the Roman retains, I'm gonna be sick to my stomach. I'm out I'm drunk. Now nah, he need a break though. My dog need a break though. He needs to go on vacation yeah. with his children and shit. My boy been working nonstop for two months. Um, what been up with the Rock though? Man? Like, are you serious? <laughs> this nigga does the, not. The like Rock's movie. fully back in. I want to say real quick though. Um, <laughs> NCAA basketball. Paige versus Caitlin is the battle of who's the best player. Who's the best player in women's Thank college. you. Oh, Thank oh, you. Oh, Paige versus oh, Caitlin really yeah. is. It's really yeah. Bad. I can't oh, wait. Oh, Paige. Oh, 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 Paige. Show the world. Paige. You gonna show your mic? Say this real quick. If Brianna Stewart was not alive. That girl from Iowa is dope. That's I hear Brianna Stewart's a real deal. I'm saying, don't be wrong. Bro, hold on. Hold on. Wait, 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 you never saw what Candace Parker did. Like, Candace Parker was like, yeah. Yeah, Candace Parker listen, was like that. Bro, I'm going to tell you right now. No, 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 no. Maya bro, Moore? Listen, listen. I'm going to tell you right now. You don't remember Maya Moore. You do not remember Diana Taurasi. You clearly don't remember. You, you clearly don't remember Stierro Soups. If hey, I'm, I'm talking, what I'm trying to tell you. What I'm trying to tell you about these names that I listed. Let me finish. Because yes. you're going to talk to me about all the points and threes she's made. Because that's because that's what that's going to be your argument. All I'm going to tell you, all these players got the same number of All-Americans as Caitlin. Yep. All the same number of Player of the Years as Caitlin. Don't yep. forget, Paige Becker's won a Player of the Year on Caitlin's yep. watch. Hey, he watch tore an ACL. He tore an ACL for a half the season. You, hey, you disrespecting Asia Wilson and what she was saying. I'm about to say, dog. Asia Wilson might be the greatest female basketball player of all time. Let me finish. You're not going to say, because you saying if it wasn't for Brianna Stewart, she'd be the GOAT. Caitlin Clark. You forgot about, about Brittany Griner. You, Brit, you know, she's not about to pull a Cam Newton. I'm not gonna lie. Not, not All you Cam niggas, Newton, hey, I'll be real with you. You niggas who don't really watch hey, women's J- basketball, J- don't watch this year. The last two years, I don't really watch this game. I don't really watch this game. I'm gonna say this right now. I'm gonna say this right now. I'm gonna say this right now. I'm not trying to sound like I'm not trying. I'm not trying to sound like a jackass to none of y'all. I'm not gatekeeping women's basketball, but I'm covered women's basketball for years now. I'm literally engulfed in the space. I'm going to tell y'all right now, a lot of you new niggas are just Thank finding you. out about the game. Thank enjoy you. it. Enjoy it. I want you to know, enjoy it. Enjoy it. But you niggas is not experts in this shit at all. Y'all not. You, and, and, you cannot and, say, you, you, you cannot come into this job two years and say, okay, like, I have no idea how to get girls. I know what I'm saying. I'm not saying that to you, Trent. I'm not saying that, you, I'm not saying that just to you, Trent. I'm just saying in, in a generality. Oh, yeah. Y'all saying, listen, hey, 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 y'all saying, you do. Cause y'all y'all said, like, they're just feeling like in some ways it's feeling like early. I think you agree. I think it's starting to feel like it almost like women's basketball started a year ago. Exactly. And <laughs> like what Brianna Stewart did in her career. Is absolutely insane. Maya Moore, bro. But no, then, no. <laughs> But y'all, I, y'all talking about Diana Juju did. being smooth on the court. Like, y'all had no idea who a Ricky Omogu or Omoguana is. Like, 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 like Brittany, him, dog. Brittany, like oh, Brittany Grinder. Like, y'all forgetting about Ricky Grinder. Like that. The the Mika ball. Catchings. Like, we got a Maya Girl, Moore right? and Diana. Maya Moore and Diana Taurasi. Y'all gotta really understand. Like, UConn. When y'all think that UConn was an undefeated Alabama like juggernaut during the Brianna Stewart era, when they was with Diana and Maya, they was losing games. They was they was going through real Come seasons. On, they would be 30 and 5, on, 30 29 and 8. They were having real seasons, but Come they was always coming back on top of the end. So I just I understand. I understand that when we go down the top 10 best players of all time, is Kaylin Clark, Kaylin Clark will go into that for sure. Top 10, top eight. She's eight or nine for me. She's eight or nine. But she, she as but, much as we like Angel but Reese. We gotta chill out. As, as much as we like Angel Reese, uh, Aaliyah Boston destroys her. 
It why wouldn't even be a close game. Why why also, Aaliyah Boston would violate. Like, it would violate like, the week. Let's relax. Let's just, all I want to say is that let's relax with this. She's the goat. The goat. The goat. The goat no, no, that's fine. But, but oh, fuck it. Her, her uncle is Al Jefferson. <laughs> Based on what we know about Cam Newton. Yo, I'm not going to lie, yeah, Riddell. You're not going to hit me with this Cam Newton logic. It's no, no, not no, the same no, at all. On, it's on, not the on, same, bro. On, she so not if she same. has the – in terms of this season, she played like the best player this season. Mm-hmm. And in terms of this team, it's not like – She so don't have the up. greatest single season in WNBA history. Exactly. I mean, in college, exactly. that's, exactly. that's what you're going to try to tell me. That's what you're going to tell me. And and again, Riddell, ask that question. He didn't even finish the season. Riddell, ask me this question when you've learned about more seasons in w, in, in college women's basketball history. Because her season that she will have with Iowa has been replicated before. She's not the only one to have done what she's done. So all I'm going to say is go and look. Because then I'm going to tell you how the other issue when it comes to using the Cam Newton argument that Trent is going to leave out is that they have to leave. You don't have to leave the court in football. I mean, in basketball. In football, you have to leave the field. The degree Facts. of difficulty of what Cam did is even harder than what Facts. what what they would, what you would have to do in basketball because the whole point of him just playing offense is what made it so impressive. So let's let's learn about let's learn more history about the college game first before we go down that rabbit hole. Cheryl yeah. Miller is like Will Chamberlain mythology. Like what she was doing in college isn't real. If you go look at Cheryl Miller watch, numbers, especially. it's not I'm real. Not yeah. Nobody's Excuse me. Listen, on some real that. shit though, and I ain't trying to be an asshole. When you can name me without Googling 15 WNBA, when you can name me without Googling 15 WNBA players, then you can talk about the game. But a lot of you niggas can't name past five players. Like, this this really been a sport they've been doing for a long time, dog. Like, again, even the Asia Wilson, like, we talk about Asia Wilson and what she's done, and what South Carolina has done. Yeah, the last she was tough. Years. Everybody like, knew come on, Asia Wilson like, was like, at South Carolina. But Caitlin Clark is in that. They would have put Asia. Asia, not, Asia was so here. good at six four. They would have put her on Caitlin and would have shut all that shit down. Early. Caitlin, Caitlin, Caitlin Clark, Clark is not a top five all time conversations. Caitlin Clark is not a top five all time conversations. Conversation. She's not. Right. She's they would have put Asia at six four on Caitlin, saying, "Hey, hold that down," and she would have stuck with her too. So Caitlin's not in like the all-time conversation at all. She's not a top five. No, she she's is. just she the is. most hyped no, because today's she she is. Is. She's, she's in the top five. She's in the top five. She is. She's the all-time. She's the all-time leading scorer. She won thousand percent. Yeah, she's in. But the at the end of the day, though. But at the end of the day, y'all. Let's also remember, she has to win this championship to be the goat. So if she don't win no championship, and and also even if she wins the championship. And even if she wins the championship, she definitely not to go over Brianna. I'm gonna let y'all know right now. Yeah, she's not. And, and I'm gonna let y'all know another thing too. Y'all understand, Juju Juju Watkins it already broke the rookie record for points in the season. She catch Caitlyn. We're gonna have other conversations. Come on, man. Nice. Nice. All, all, nice. all I'm saying is, all and Caitlyn ain't got a better you know, three than Donna Tarasi. Period. And, 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 and period. a terrible, and a terrible but logic with Tino's with Tino's ball. Because Pete, Pete Maravich, Pete Maravich is not to go to college basketball. Yeah, yeah, hey, he, hey, because you know, not. hey, you know, hey, you know who in them conversations for the goat? That unibrow, that nigga AD. Yeah. Listen, oh, no, I'm Kareem. It's Kareem, but Kareem is the goat. But Kareem is the goat of college Jay basketball. Jay Rob, Jay Rob, you think you think you think Kaylin shoot better than Tarasi? I seen Tarasi live in, in person. Thank you. Like, <laughs> okay, thank no, you. Bro, 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 is, bro. 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 Brianna Stewart. Brianna Stewart has the most perfect Listen, college I'll, career out of anybody. She has the most perfect college career out of anybody. I want. I, I just want. I just want y'all to know. I, I watched. I've seen Diana Tarasi because I was. A, I was a. I was a. Uh, for the Phoenix Mercury, I worked as a practice player during COVID, um, in 2020, 2021, and twenty twenty two. I got to watch Brittany Griner and Kaylin Clark. I mean, Clayton Clark and Diana Tarasi. Excuse me. Live and direct. That I, pick and roll close. game. That pick and pop it's game. Close. Come on, it's dog. Close. It's close. Uh, it's close, but Diana. Diana Taurasi is the reason why Brittany Griner developed a mid-range shot. Like, she's admitted it. Like, she helped her on her jump shot. How, yeah. man, come on, y'all. Y'all, y'all can watch this game, dog. All it's right. cool, though. It's getting popular, right, chat. It's cool, we got, a, we got a slide, though, chat. We love that y'all watching. I love that we even having these debates. It creates new discourses.